welcome. Oh, it's time to bust out the cola. Oh. It's time to get a sip of cola. Let's have some sip of cola. That's me. That's literally me. Oh my god. Wait, Peppy changed his picture. Wait, Peppy changed his profile picture. Guys. He's all lasered up. Do you see this? What could this mean? Does this have a deep meaning? Is he prepared now that laser is ready for release? Or are they just changing because he thought it looked cooler? You decide. Who won? Who's next? You decide. Uh, big rap battles. Epic rap battles of Osu. It says you're going live now. Good. I have good things to watch. Trust me. Good morning. Oh, did I? Did I hit it? Wait, I didn't even check. Oh, guys! Guys, fellas! Why is this music so loud? It's not just me going deaf, right? The music's a little loud. Guys! <laughs> we did it! We did it! Ten... Thousand followers. What time is it for you right now? Noon. It's high noon. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, you know, someone replied to this BTMC tweet. I gotta find this. It was like, you trying to, to make OC look cool is really cringe. Oh yeah, yeah. Dude, just shut up. Just enjoy the content. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Who cares, dude? Attorney starts today? Yeah, apparently so. 10k schizophrenics. It's true, it's true. That Mr. Eck in the vid, yeah, that's what the that's what the reveal is. Haven't you seen this? Now I don't know why they show him playing a map that's not dense, and then you hear his keyboard. So they they show you they show him doing a jump map, and you you hear his keyboard going like like he's he's like <laughs> like okay okay just watch this just watch. Wait, you, you see that? Wait, 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 wait. Can, can we listen to these taps again? <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Oh man. Oh, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I thought the video looked pretty clean. I think it's a good promo for the round table, but apparently people are like. It's cringe. Dude. Dude. It's Osu. Anything you do in Osu is gonna be cringe. <laughs> You're behind the curve. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I guess it means face reveal. I don't know.
man. Thought that was pretty pretty epic. Thanks for the follow. I'm sorry, I'm distracted. I'm just reading through the thread again. Why did they send pizza time, pizza time? Wait, I remember this. This was a classic. This used to be the meme, dude. Remember this? How will I hear this? Guys, these dudes weren't even around in 2015. Every time Cookie Z would play this, or like anyone would play this, everyone would spam pizza time. It would be like, oh, it's pizza time. People don't remember these memes. Oh my god, that's insane. Pizza time was the first thing I heard when I heard this song. Yeah, that's different. What is this? How to destroy your laptop keyboard death stream 200 BPM FC. What is this? Maybe if you didn't tap so hard. <laughs> troll face. See, the troll face part is me saying that. Hello. Hello, everyone. FC. 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 It's pretty good. <laughs> oh, my God, dude. That's a classic. That's a classic. He's not over streaming 200 BPM. This should not be possible. Hi, Crazy Loop. Hello, chat. I'm on vacation right now. It's awesome. Very nice. Why doesn't Kek W appear in stream chat? What? What? Oh, is it because it's better TTV? I don't think I have it added in. Wait. Yeah, why doesn't it? Wait. What? I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> does, uh, does, do, do the other emotes? Give me a bunch of other emotes, do they? That works. Is your day going pretty good? So we have some pretty epic scores. I don't know if you guys saw, at least someone posted this in Discord. I don't know if it was a troll. Okay, it wasn't a troll. Um, what? <laughs> yeah, don't worry, Shimon's just existing. Shimon really do just be existing. Yeah, that's the only score. Probably because everyone's uh, going to LA, LA right now. LLLA. -L 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 <laughs> your graph is insane. Here, let me see their graph. I gotta, I gotta check this out. Look at this graph. <laughs> it's pretty sold. We watched Marianne. We watched Marianne, but we gotta check this one out. Look at this. Look at this. This, what is wrong with Chivon, dude? I don't even know what to say. <laughs> just Dark Boy Trigger, but faster. Not even a hard guessing. I'm just I'm just in for the ride. It's Shimon's world and we're living in it, dude. 
Like, could Emrek do this? I feel like this is just too fast, you know? Shimon is setting the team of plays like I wish I could see from Emrek. What do you mean? You can't just hit that. That's messed up. That's messed up. This score is messed up, dude. This score is messed up. <laughs> oh my god. Really? Really? No! <laughs> no more to snow! It can't be true. It can't be true. Oh, five, Beth. You came in at the perfect time. Came in at the best time. You know why? Because now. What is this thumbnail? You're right. What is this thumbnail? Because now I want to look at this old clip, okay? This is an old Osu clip uploaded January 2015. Right? Of Wubblefolf going God mode. God mode on these jumps. And I want you to look at this and I want you to, to think to yourself nowadays, wow, is this God mode? Because we've come so far. We really have. Anyone remember this video? No, you gotta see it. You gotta see it to believe it. Because back then, this was insane. Yes, it's the red like roses one. Dude. I just I love I love he keeps cutting back to the spectator chat. They're just Freaking out. Dude, this is. I could do this. Thanks for the follow. Look at that. Oh, I just thought about that. That that clip's so good. That clip's really good. It just shows you how far we've come in terms of, like, aim <laughs> and everything. <laughs> so I, people were really good in 2015, but <sighs> that still just eluded them completely. Man. Then, like, do you guys remember, uh... Oh man, what's what's a good one? Like like Nico is a god of squares. That's that's a classic. Look at this. <laughs> I used to watch this clip like once a week and I was like, "Oh my god, how can he hit this?" That's ridiculous. The skin's so good, it works so well as overlay. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good, I will admit. Man. 
man. That's just a very good clip. Right there. Ugh, I gotta think of some old, like, like, oh my god, X player going god mode, and it's just like, it's something we've gone far past. I gotta, I gotta find more of those. Cookie Z masterpiece play, true. Ah, dude, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. You guys remember the old Raphis live play? You guys remember Raphis' first live play? To prove that he wasn't cheating. There it is. He had to do his live play to prove that he wasn't cheating. Raphis' is Look at that. Oh yeah, dude. This is true music. Yeah. It's like it's like a clock on the phone. Classical uh, classical era. Good days. Good timing. True. Oh, True. that's FC. <laughs> that applause sound. That applause sound. <laughs> oh, that's FC. Oh my god. Oh, that one got me. That one got me. All right. Let's choose a keyword for this. People are here now. Fire. Fire. I'm just like that song. It goes fire. T T T T W E R K. Yeah, yeah. You guys remember this? Nobody. Ever, I don't think people remember this this song or this map. This used to be pretty popular. <laughs> Do people remember this? Yeah, this map's pretty fire. <laughs> he says fire in the song. Fire! You see that? <laughs> Two twenty version of the song. Oh, he doesn't know. You don't know that this song changes BPM. Oh, that's a good video. That's actually a really good video. Okay, hold on. I want to watch that condition there. That's why this song was so cool. Here it is. Here's the speed up. Also, oh my god, dude. 424 PP back then. Oh my god. That's nothing. I hope that's worth more now. I, I guaranteed that got buffed at least slightly by the rework, but I don't think it's worth like anything at all. Where is it? 446. It got buffed by like 20 PP. Ugh. Ugh. 
Maps like this will never be worth anything. I think we just have to accept that. Dude, the Kevin Celadiff on this is so stupid. I say that because I slider broke on the easy part. What's wrong with me? Okay, apparently everybody else slider breaks on this too. So, I'm not alone. I'm not alone. I'm not afraid, I'm not afraid to take a stand, take a stand, everybody. <laughs> uh, Alright, keyword is, is fire. I'll come back to that. You, you uploaded the 1985 and 1985 act. Reality You're insane. You're insane. You're deranged. Why? What? So you do the lineup. Okay. Okay. There you go. Yikes, what went wrong? <laughs> Nothing went wrong, I can assure you. Look at the, look at the, look at the. Hey, hey, let me look at the score. There you go. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Peggy, get him. And the laser beam strike from Ichiro. Oh, man. I enjoy my <laughs> beautiful, 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 beautiful. <laughs> you can hear it when you hear it. That's a serious, like, when you hear it moment. Oh my god. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm dying. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm mentally back. I swear. Guys, I'm not lying. I'm telling you a truth. <laughs> All right. So, any any other fires? Are we ready to roll it already? What are you guys? Come on, come on. What are you What are you doing? What are you doing? Where's the fire? All you gotta do is to fire in the chat, man. Osu stream technique for dummies? I don't even know this video. I don't even know this video. I've never seen this. I'm not doing that. <laughs> Morn is one of the few people who does not want to do that. I'm sorry, I need to hear it again. I need to hear it again, okay? Long ball base in in the right field. Heading for third is Terrence Long. The throw by Ichiro. Beautiful. Peggy got him. Holy smoke. A laser beam strike from Ichiro to the third baseman, David Bell. And Terrence Long is got. God, that's so good. 
That's so good. It's just like finding out the original Jinkala. Why are Jinkala? Why are Jinkala? Guys, we should go down the Jinkala rabbit hole next. Okay. Hey. Right. That sounds like, okay. I have a good idea. Yeah, we can do that. All right. You ready to roll it? You guys ready to roll it or what? <laughs> is it time or is it time? Fire. What is the roll for? <laughs> it's just. I just. I. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's for a profile review. A profile review. Where I review your profile. That's it's what it's for. Now you know. That's what we do around here. We do things a little bit differently around here. Sorry, I get distracted. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm gonna hit it. I'm gonna hit it right now. Dark Flight Room, you're late. You're freaking late. We already watched the scores for today. Okay. Sisu. Sisu. Wow. Wow. Okay, we got your profile. Nice. Okay, you guys ready? First profile review of the day. What's... What is this? What is... Grande Ritorno Su Osu. <laughs> what, is, what, what is this? Hold on, I'm, I'm distracted now. <laughs> I feel like I should look this up. I feel like I should find out what this is, but who knows. Player, since May 2019, which was three years ago. Oh my god, three years? Years. Any translators? Well, how about, how about what, 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 any translators? We have the person who, who is the profile in the chat. What do you mean? <laughs> we don't need any translators. <laughs> big comeback on Osu. Oh, oh yeah. The, so, grande big retorno return to Osu. <laughs> That's crazy. I, I want to hear that. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say that. It lines up. It makes sense. It makes sense. I understand. See, I'm so Italian. You should basically just give me the spaghetti already. Look at this. 266 hours. So not even really a full year worth of playtime. I don't know if you're playing more casually, if your hours are more spread out. We'll probably see that in the historical section. But hey, you know, just keep playing, keep gaming, and you'll get this. It's true. I should... Dude, we should do a stream where it's just me and Spaza, and we react to, like, American food. <laughs> Is, isn't that the, that's the stereotype, right? That, that, uh, Italian people, whatever they see cooking, whenever they see someone break the spaghetti, they're like, Oh, what are you doing? You can't do that. You have to be kidding me. He go. You can't do that. <laughs> I want to do it. I watched this video. Okay. I, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I saw, it's just because you had this Italian text in the top. I saw a video. <laughs> Like a couple weeks ago, that was, there was there was some woman who was like taking my Italian boyfriend to Olive Garden. 
And it was amazing. It was amazing. Because you, you, he gets in there, he, he sits down, he's like, why is it called Olive Garden? Like, what is Olive Garden? <laughs> and, and she's like, okay, you, you know, it's, 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 you get, you get Italian food. You got your stuff, you get your, uh, you know, fettuccine Alfredo, you got your breadsticks. He's like, uh, he's like, okay, full fettuccine Alfredo isn't Italian. That's, that's an American dish. Breadsticks? What do you mean? Like, like, is it bread? He's like, like, she's like, yeah, it's like, it's like, you know, you know it's like, a. a a sort of thing of bread, but it's 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 small and short. He's like like a baguette. <laughs> it's like he doesn't get it. <laughs> he doesn't understand. And she's like, yeah, and you dip it in marinara sauce. And he's like, what's marinara? <laughs> <laughs> it's like it blew my mind. I was like, oh my god, dude. As an American, we know nothing about Italian cuisine, really. <laughs> Watch the short. Okay, okay. This better be a good short. Breaking spaghetti. Is this enough for both of us? Is this enough for both of us? Nah, a little bit more. Okay, I'm going to... Sara, but you say bad, Sara. What? Sara, you... What? It's enough, and we don't have to eat this shit pasta so short. What do you mean? I just... This is not spaghetti, my love. Come on. It doesn't fit in the pan. Why do you understand me? No, you can't cut the pasta so... But I was just... It just didn't fit in the pan. My husband, I don't... I think it might have been this channel. I think it might have been this channel, actually, unironically. Do they go to Olive Garden? Olive Garden? It might have been the video that I watched. It was! It was this video! It was this video! Okay, I, I'm so sorry that I'm distracting from your profile review, but you can, as an authentic Italian, you can you can give us a review of this American uh, Italian food. <laughs> You can, you can tell what us. What is up, you guys? Come on, get out of your seatbelt. Carlos is very upset. Mean, I'm not... uh, say hello to our friends. Okay. I'm a little bit inside. Ambiance. Yes. Stop it. fry. Yeah. Carlos having an issue right now because. What is that? There's chicken shrimp carbonara. And he's confused. Shrimp, but it's fried with bacon, so there is chicken. Fish. And meat together. <laughs> and meat. I think you should get that one to try it. One that I die. You dunk the breadsticks <laughs> in the marinara. In the marinara. Mhm. Mm yes, that old. I'll show you. It's really yummy. It's really yummy. No thing. So I am scared. I am shook for this. I found chicken shrimp and carbonara. This is. Dude, it's funny because the breadsticks are actually kind of good. <laughs> He's just like, he's shocked. He's like appalled. Uh, Made me very mad because the carbonara, carbonara, <laughs> it's my favorite pasta. Another thing that I uh, am shocked oh that my God, uh, Alfredo with everything, with the shrimp, with the fettuccine, with the chicken, with the seafood. Is Alfredo in Italy popular? No, for nothing. The first time that they hear fettuccine Alfredo was here in America. <laughs> Yeah, they don't know. They don't know what fettuccine Alfredo is, because uh, from what I understand, it was it was a dish uh, invented by uh, Italian uh, immigrants to America. So, like, actually, back in Italy, they have no idea. <laughs> you know, it makes sense. It's crazy, dude. It's just crazy. <laughs> oh, no one knows anything. <laughs> I'm excited to try the bread sandwich. I can't understand what these are. Americans know nothing, dude. A long piece of bread. And a baguette. <laughs> yeah, he's like, she's like, it's, it's just like a long piece of bread. He's like, a baguette. A whole baguette. And a the restaurant we eat French. Put a stick in the marinara. Okay, okay, if you were, uh, for all the non-Americans in chat, these breadsticks kind of slap, though. These breadsticks are probably the best thing at Olive Garden. <laughs> Uh, you have to open and put No, you just dunk it in and you eat it. You have to put it in the marinara. It's good. Yeah. So what's See, you for my See even the Italians like, mm, yeah, it's good. <laughs> That's how you know. That's how you know. Marinara. They call that sauce. Marinara. Yes. <laughs> they call that sauce marinara. <laughs> Dude, he doesn't even know marinara. What do they, what do they, what do they, I, okay, the, there must be so many foods that have marinara though. 
Like, what is? What do they put on? You know, like like half of the foods that we eat. What do they actually have in Italy? I don't know. No, you you're not missing the profile review. This is part of the profile review. Yes. So he's not bad yet. Thanks God. How to bring the seeker? Uh, honestly, I like him. The songs. Are... <laughs> this is amazing. Wait, wait. Absolutely not. Would you make it in Italy? Yeah, I'll be Maybe another time. Oh, oh, okay, okay, this service is good. You ready? Carlo is gonna cry. Carlo is literally about to cry. <laughs> we were just talking about it, and carbonara is already egg, which also that doesn't even look like carbonara, that looks like Alfredo. <laughs> He's so sad. He's so sad. I would eat that. I would eat that. That looks pretty good. <laughs> What is that? But this is no carbonara. Why? Can you explain to me spoon? But it doesn't look bad. For you, yeah, but not. No, you know what I mean. Like it doesn't look disgusting. Like it doesn't. Look... So the carbonara white. He disagrees. He politely disagrees. <laughs> I think that is a friend is no shrimp, shrimp, chicken. It's like a carbonara. soup. You can eat it as a soup. For this, they give us a big tag. I think that there is milk. So, carbonara without tag, with milk. and uh, Just eat it. It's made with pee pee. <laughs> what does he think? Okay. Okay. Honest opinion. Honest opinion, please. Is this an honest opinion happening right now? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Honest opinion. <laughs> I think that you can eat this. It's not something, oh, it's impossible to eat the same de lasagna last time. Yeah. Somebody loved this. I don't know how, <laughs> but somebody loved it. But the situation that in Anna Carbonara there is kitchen, pepperoni, shrimp, meat, bacon and no guanciale, but I can understand. And the pasta is very cooked. Very cooked. So it's not al dente. Man. He's not angry, just disappointed. <laughs> so true. So true. Oh my god, dude. That video. The video, okay, sorry, I just, uh, I need, I need to show Spatza this. Dude, Spatza needs to get a plane to America, and then, and then we take him to, to every, every American food place. <laughs> it's true. Torture. That would be great. What do you, what, what do you do, like, like, what if you're Italian? Right? And then you come to America and you try like one of these fake Italian dishes and you actually end up liking it. Like, what do you do? What would you do with yourself? You'd be like, I know this is fake. I know this is bad, but I like this. How would you live? <laughs> one of my famous burgers. So true. <coughs> oh my God, dude. It's like the same thing with American Chinese food. True. Oh man. It's just it's just I don't know. It's it's amazing. Anyway, rank score, got an okay amount. Uh hit accuracy 98.42. Very good hit accuracy. Hey, keep that up there. That's that's pretty solid. Keep it around floating around like 98, you'll be good. You'll continue being good. Profile review, by the way. Yeah, I know, I know. American food in other countries. No, okay, okay, this is true though. I don't know if I trust another country to do a burger, right? <laughs> like a true and honest burger. <laughs> hmm, I don't know, what other American food is there? <laughs> what other food has been invented in America? <laughs> Fettuccine Alfredo, they'll never do it, right? <laughs> Oh man, burgers aren't even from America as well. I mean, I guess that's true. Hot dogs are terrible in America. I don't know. 
I'm, I haven't had a good hot dog in a really long time, but that is, I don't know. Ugh. I feel like you cannot get a cheap hot dog, otherwise it's just gonna suck. Hot dogs scare you. Oh man. 16 gay play count. Okay, with 3.2 million total hits does bring you about the middle of average for hits per play, which is fine, especially as a newer player, you would expect this number to be a bit lower, right? So, <clears throat> keep doing what you're doing, but we do have two recommendations to help you out. You ready? I've actually never had the $1.50 Costco uh, hot dog. I've never had that. I feel like I, I need to try that. As an American, I feel like I need to try this. I have not, though. The Ninja Mouse? Oh my god. Is it the one with holes in it? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> you guys remember the, the mouse with holes in it? <laughs> no holes? Okay, good. I hate those. Anytime I see those, it makes me wanna it makes me wanna punch a hole in my wall. <laughs> makes me wanna punch a series of holes in my wall to make my wall lighter. <laughs> oh man. Okay, okay. <coughs> the Europe moment kinda true. So for this, like I said, two recommendations, okay? We keep getting I'm getting sidetracked so hard on this profile review. I'm so sorry. One, try not to retry spam, right? It's a bad habit, everyone does it, where you sit down, you play a map again and again and again and again, and you end up playing it like 20 or 50 times in a session, right? Bad thing to do, don't want to do that, right? Because you can end up over-practicing patterns, you could learn bad muscle memory, you could even mind block yourself out of being able to do the map without realizing it, right? It's, it's just easier to give yourself, you know, say, three or five plays, right, on that map, and then you move on to, to something else, and you give that one three to five plays, and you move on, right, because then you're able to, to move on to different maps, practice different skills during that time that you would have spent only playing one single map and only focusing on one single, you know, type of patterns and stuff. So it's much better just to limit yourself in that way. We all do it. Everyone does it. Every top player does it too, and hopefully, you know, they catch themselves and they're like, oh, whoops, I shouldn't be retry spamming. Whoops, let me, let me just stop that right now, you know? But it's something to think about in the future. Number two is, of course, playing maps all the way through, start to finish. Even if you miss, even if you miss, it's worth playing maps all the way through, okay? Because you get to practice the patterns of a map evenly, right? Imagine, you know, you keep retrying at, at the middle of it. You're only really practicing the beginning and the middle of the map. You're not even getting to the ending, which oftentimes is the hardest part of the map now. So it's easier just to just to try and play all the way through, start to finish, get as much practice in as you can in those, you know, couple of like five tries or whatever. So uh, uh, those two things will help you out greatly because, you, you know, especially uh, playing maps all the way through is a huge consistency builder. It'll help you learn to perform on demand and FC maps on demand as you need to. So very great stuff. Keep those those two hobbies, hobbies, habits. That's the word. Habits with you forever and they will they will greatly help you out max combo 1628 dude i have no idea <laughs> the the combo is so low that i don't know but should i guess i i think like that's around no it can't be sun glow i don't know what it is I, yeah no i don't know what it is so if you know what your highest combo is feel free to tell us but what's the average hits per play between like 150 and 250 Speaking of Italian cuisine, I'm going to the store to buy frozen pizza. Oh yeah. <laughs> Funny hollow live map. Interesting. Interesting. All right. So we'll look at your S's and SS's. We generally like to see these added up about equal to or even higher than your A's, right? Because it shows consistency, just like we were talking about before. The more S ranks that you accrue over time, you don't really go back and replace those with A's, right? So it shows that you are at least going out of your way to FC maps and, you know, make sure that you are consistent at a certain skill level, right? Because cons consistency we talk about at least uh, most oftenly in terms of, of FCing things, right? Because you got to think... If someone's playing, you know, seven star maps, if they're they're getting couples of misses on, on seven stars maps, you, you would expect them to be able to FC, you know, a four star map if you give it to them or even a five star map. Right. And if they can't do that, then their consistency might be, uh, you know, iffy. So it's something to work on. It's something to think about. But uh, that's not to say that uh, getting A's and not getting FC's is bad. Right. 
That's because it, it, it's pretty solid. It's pretty solid a, a method of improving because you will always be challenging yourself. You'll always be pushing your own limits. You, if you are playing maps where the aim is so hard that you're missing, the, the, the tapping is so hard that you're missing, and, and you're dropping accuracy, and you know the reading's so hard, that you, you're, you're missing a couple patterns, but you're pretty much almost there, you are helping yourself improve, right? You are helping yourself improve. So make sure that you are doing those maps that push your own limits, that uh, push you to uh, become a better player, that go outside of your comfort zone oftentimes, right? Is they will help you out alongside the FCs. It's more, it's like a balance between the two. You gotta figure out, you know, oh, do I need to practice consistency or do I need to, to push my skill cap further? So just think about that with yourself. Think about what you need to do, right? Think about what level you're consistent on and, and if, you're, if you're really happy with that, okay? Music slash game enjoyer. You got some peripherals, like we said, the ninja mouse. Currently learning tablet. Oh. So much for the ninja mouse. <laughs> oh man. Okay, okay. Interesting. Oh, you got Nat 20. Ooh, spicy. Probably unintentionally. That's that's another random metal. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely random. Okay. We'll have a little bit to say about that in a bit. But we'll look at your pin scores. Um hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. <laughs> okay. Okay. So you got lots of like like longer, higher star maps, which you know I, I think some of these are, are gonna be helping you out. Like this is pretty solid. Look at this. A two miss on monochrome with 97 act. That's really good. That's really good. Now a lot of it still seems a bit hard for you. Uh, I definitely probably need to get your, your streaming and your finger control and maybe even just your stamina up a bit to be able to do that But you know, you know, you know This is a bit better. It's really just finger control that's holding you back probably stamina as well Because you'll lose stamina and then you'll start like under streaming and, and that ruins your, your F control and stuff like that so <laughs> Maybe once you work on on stamina finger control, this will be something that's possible. This one's really hard This one's very very quite hard. So very interesting. You have this. Why is this pinned? One of these is not like the others. I can tell you that much already. <laughs> One miss on that. It's pretty solid. Pretty solid aim. Hmm. Oh boy. Okay, I'm interested. We'll look at your top plays. Not always your best plays. Don't worry. We we recognize that PP is imperfect. It's not the best system ever, but you know that's how it be. All right, this is a pretty. This is like a a, a short-ish streamy kind of one. It's, it's it has a little stream in it. You know, I know this. So, it's pretty interesting that that's your top play, Blue Zenith Cover. Okay, so definitely some stream ups. I'm not sure how you're feeling about aim because you know usually people have have aim like at the very top, if if not close to. Which I mean, you do have it pretty close, but. Think about that if that's a weak point if if aim consistency or just aiming in general you know jumpy aim sort of thing is is an issue then that's probably something you need to to, to practice a little bit more just a little bit more not, not a ton more because i mean you do have these up here and it does take aim to play you know half of this other stuff anyway it's pretty solid thanks for the follow keeping these fundamentals good you're getting really good accuracy on on a lot of these plays bully brap right so Keeping keeping that going, you know what I'm saying? I think you'll find that, that the best thing you can do... Why is everyone checking their watch time now? <laughs> the best thing you can do is is get your fundamentals super strong, right? Get your... You're just, just playing stuff with Nomad that's just has like jumps and streams, right? The very generic like normal maps. That's the, getting that strong as strong as you possibly can is the best thing you can do and from there you branch out into different skill sets right because from there uh, a jumpy aim might turn into like awkward aim or, or high precision aim where the circles get smaller or linear aim right and then tapping can 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 go into speed stamina finger control you know all this other stuff that you wouldn't necessarily uh, think of from there so as long as your fundamentals are super rock solid then then you can help yourself get into the other stuff. Make sure you do get into the other stuff too, right? Be playing, you know, tech maps. Be playing, you know, all this, these other things. And you might say, oh, their tech maps are really hard, but there's some, some good resources to find stuff. If you ever know a map that's like really hard, I mean, a lot of times, often, they'll have lower diffs, right? Like Neuronessia, 
and I mean most of the other tech maps I know, right? It's not just the the top diff, right? The, this insane is pretty solid. Oh, it's over five stars now. This used to be only like 4.5 stars or something. This one's very solid for a uh, for it, it's like light tech. It's like the top diff light edition, right? It, it'll get you the techy sorts of rhythms, maybe even some of the slider patterns without actually being like like impossibly hard to understand. You know what I mean? So. That's a that's a, a thing to think about. Okay. Still some solid stuff. Lots of FCs there. Uh, well, now that I say that, lots of chokes. So maybe these are plays that you should really go back and fix, right? Because if you've improved at tapping, if you've improved at aim at any time in the past two months, three months, five months, six months, then these are plays that you could probably do. Okay. So seriously, try it out. See what you can do. Fix some of these old plays. I know that oftentimes people just forget about them. They forget about the, you know, these maps and, and they're like, oh wait, I didn't even know that that was, you know. So see, see if you can get your own like new best on this map and you might get a score that you might not have expected before, right? This is the thing, like, like I say, improvement above all else, right? If you just get yourself to improve, then getting scores is the easy part, right? Getting PP is the easy part and everything Thanks else. The I probably don't retry that map because of the song. Well, I just pointed out like four different maps. So, and it's not just these, right? It, sure, there might be one that, where you don't like the song or whatever, but there's like a million of these, right? That you just haven't played in, in, in so long, like seven months, six months. All right, not that, wait, where'd it go? The five months, there's there. There's that. Three months, Gourmet Race. <laughs> I like the song Gourmet Race, you know? So these are things that you could potentially fix if you've improved your aim and tapping. Now, maybe they haven't pr improved enough to be able to confidently FC it, you know, without any effort. And that's fine. You know what you do? You throw it on the back burner. You say, I'll try that again in like two more weeks once I've gained enough skill to, to maybe do it, right? And then the cycle repeats. So you can, you, you, you just kind of keep these in circulation until you're able to knock out a bunch of them or, you know, get, get them, you know, get different plays on, on like, uh, uh, more maps that you haven't played before, right? Rather than recycling the same maps that you have played. Still, don't necessarily want to see Bs in top plays, not that often, unless you're really pushing your limits, which, I mean, I guess you kind of eh, so are, right, in this play, but, you know, keep grinding, keep grinding, and focus on the accuracy. Focus on getting, you know, 97% plus. Maybe on, on some of these maps that are really, really hard, maybe, like, just for now, 96% plus, right? Something like that, but 97 should be the baseline that you really think about, so... You'll get there, you're gonna get there, right? It might seem like, oh my God, that takes so much stamina. That's so hard for right now, but it's it's all technique. The, and the longer that you grind, the, the easier it'll become, you know? Nobody's born doing this. Nobody's born doing this, literally, right? Uh, as much as the genetics people would like you to believe that, nobody's born alternating their fingers and knowing how to do it accurately. You just have to, to, to figure that out for yourself and learn it, you know? Still, some of these plays with mods, very interesting, especially some which aren't just jumps, which is very cool, right? Oftentimes, you'll see a lot of people just go on maps that are just jumps, right? And with mods, those maps aren't cool. really as hard as they should be. Since they are just jumps, you can just, you know, bleh, right? With both hard rock, uh, hidden, and double time, you'll see people go for those. But seeing some of these more like, like well-rounded maps that aren't just this, right, are, are really cool. So that's a really cool play, and that was 10 months ago. So I'd say um, you don't really have to care about mods now, right? But in the future, think about throwing mods on some of your plays, especially Hard Rock. Hard Rock is one that's that's much harder for people to get into, right? Because not only is the, the AR much higher, not only are the circles so much smaller, but also the hit window, right? How accurately you have to be tapping is, is so much tighter that it's just uh, all the combination of all that just throws newer players off. But once you start playing higher and higher OD, right, which is the stat that controls the hit window in Osu, then you'll you'll start getting used to it because you're playing stuff that's like oh, OD 8.6. But you got to think. Welcome, Umbre viewers. Good morning. How are you doing? Welcome. We're doing some profile reviews and watching videos in in between. Welcome. But you gotta imagine, right? If you're playing stuff that's OD 8.6 and getting like pretty solid accuracy on it, it's it's gonna be easier, you know, for you to, to start doing uh, uh, 
Only Umbre viewers, but not Umbre himself. Oh. Hello, Umbre. Let's go, Umbre. Guys, guys, can I get a can I get a clap in the chat for Umbre? Can I get a round of applause? Let's go. Let's go. Let's wait. Wait. Thanks for the follow. <laughs> Double raid. Welcome. Everyone's clapping. I don't know why we're clapping. <laughs> Welcome. We're doing profile reviews, guys, so if that sounds interesting, stick around. And also looking at, at Osu historical videos. Alright, alright. Let me finish up this profile review. Keep doing what you're doing, but uh, think about getting into stuff in the future, especially double time, right? It will help you out because it will turn maps faster, and that's what you want to, to gain speed, right? You'll see people play farm maps, right? Often you'll play people. You, you'll see people uh, play simple maps. I got one good score in four hours. Yes, that's effort well well used. <laughs> what was the score, right? But a uh, uh, double time is is what helps you because there's not a lot of maps. Once you start getting to like you know 230, 240, 250 BPM, there's not a lot of maps left, right? So you're going to have to rely on DT to make maps that fast to push your own limits, right? So and, and you're not at that yet, but there's plenty of maps that might be within your BPM range, right? Stuff that's that's 120 to 130 BPM, which is 180 to 195, right? So there that might be a starting point and you can keep raising the BPM from there. Who knows? Oh, wait, this isn't ranked. I I thought it was ranked, so I scrolled down and I was like, "Where's the leaderboard?" Where's the leaderboard? <laughs> Thanks for the follow. So there you go. So uh, think about pushing pushing your limits in, in lots of different ways, okay? It's true. Medals, you don't have to go for medals. They're like achievements in other games. I find them quite fun to go for, right? They're a different way to play. Thanks for the follow. Maybe someday you're just like, oh, I'm so tired of grinding skill. Oh, I'm just so, I don't want to do anything today. I just want to, I just want to chill out. I just want to relax. Medals might be the thing for you. You Thanks do a little follow. challenge, you get a little icon on your profile to commemorate it. And there's a ton of them. You can look them up, by the way. You can, you can look up the Hush Hush medals, but you didn't hear it from me. Osakai.net. <laughs> There's a whole community around farming metals, and it's a great thing to get into. And that's to say, you know, it's not just metals, right? Having a, a side quest, sort of in Osu, whatever you're playing, can motivate you even further, right? And it's not just metals, like I say. There's people who farm rank score. There's a whole rank score ranking. I'm I'm quite a a, a part of that community because I'm I'm quite high up. <laughs> Where am I? I'm the gatekeeper to the top eight, uh, eighty. Yeah. <laughs> I keep myself in check. I just hit 158 billion score. Let's go. Let's go. Anyway, and you know, you know, there's there's uh, other people in in other communities, right? Like you might want to complete Osu, like quite a few people are doing. I mean, that's that's a pretty big task. Maybe that's not for you, but some people are trying to play, you know, everything. And maybe you could limit yourself to like, oh, I only want to play every 2013 map or something you know you could keep yourself make your own challenges in the game right there's other people who try and go for as many ss's as they possibly can i mean look at look at these dudes look at this <laughs> what do you do if you stumble on someone's profile randomly and you see this what would you do <laughs> that's what i'm saying there's people who farm top 50s. There are people who farm number ones if they're good enough. It's just giving yourself a different challenge, right? Because if you only focus on, on grinding skill, if you only focus especially on just grinding PP, you can burn yourself Thanks out very easily, right? Especially once the PP stops coming, once the ranks stop coming, you're like, why am I doing so bad, right? So it's it's better just to keep yourself in a good mindset, keeping yourself you know away from that and realizing... Uh, you know, PP isn't everything. Let me give myself something else to do, right? Uh, so that's just a recommendation. Peaking only at 1390 plays in a month. So your one year of playtime pretty much is spread across just over one year. Or I guess you're, you're less than one year. So just keep playing. That's how you get better, right? It's just, just keep playing, really. 
That's it. There we go. Willie said play more. Yes! Yes! He said play more! Let's go! <laughs> Just keep playing. Right? And you don't really have even a lot of maps downloaded. You might think, right? You, you see this and you're like, what? I have a, I have a thousand Things maps played? That, that sounds like a lot to me, but it's really not. I'd say the average person has about like 5,000 maps played, right? So just keep downloading different maps that you've never played before, experiencing different patterns, maybe, you know, grabbing them from different people saying, hey, do you have, you know, this type of map that I'm not as familiar with? I want to try and get into this skill set, right? Because practice as many different patterns as you can, as many different skill sets as you can, because you want to be the strongest player that you can be, right? That's the uh, the goal, at least. At least I think that's the goal that you should have. So keep, keep doing stuff. We've reached the end of your profile. Any questions or anything else you want us to look at? You got good stuff. Your fundamentals are pretty strong. It's it's just branching out to the other stuff because I know that you're going for you know more more uh, uh, long stream stamina ish intensive maps, right? So that's one thing that you're going to get into. But definitely try and uh, think of some of the other the other things to uh to work on as well, right? Have you watched the profile pic? Wait, <laughs> I have not. <laughs> I have not. Is this a video that I... <laughs> Is there a difference between tapping with ring index and middle index? Uh, yeah, that, that's using two different fingers. <laughs> if you mean benefits or drawbacks? No. Thanks that's tuna. I have not seen this video. Well, yeah, but I, I have not seen this video. <laughs> it's true. Do my nose. Me nose is, is killing me today. Okay, what is this? Three mod? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh wait, wait one minute here. Thanks for the follow. <laughs> this play this play looks looks familiar to me. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> That's messed up. That's actually messed up. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, Alright. I think we pretty much covered your profile review. Guys, guys. Blue. Umbre. I have a video for you. I have a classic video. I already showed this on stream, but you're gonna love this. What do I- what do I say this? Where is this? Where do I find this? Okay, okay. <laughs> this is a classic. I just rewatched this. <laughs> And I was thinking to myself, like, okay, like, I remember this video being insane. Like, Wolf hits, like, the craziest jumps I've ever seen in my life. I look back at this because I hadn't watched this in, like, five years. It's nothing. It's literally nothing. We used to think that, like, the smallest jumps in the world were the craziest things we had ever seen. Look at this. Look at the chat reaction. Look. Unbelievable. That's my favorite message. This should not be possible. Oh my god. Average four digit today. I know. Well, that's the thing. That's, that's the crazy part. Look at that. Not only... Not only were they freaking out then, this video got 300,000 views in 2015 because this was such a crazy play. God, it's just it's just a reminder that we've we've come so far in terms of aim. Like aim was really unexplored before like PPV2, you know, and stuff like this. Like this was was the peak of aim. I guess maybe Cookie Z was the peak of aim around this time still, but you know what I mean? We've changed. We've changed as a society. Wonder what 2030 aim will be like. True. 
Yeah, that's that's crazy, dude. And also, I mean, back at this time, same time, basically. Only a couple months later. This is the leaderboard where where you see the leaderboard at this at the end. Wolf gets the uh, the fifth FC on Airman. <laughs> oh my god, dude. That's how many people had seen Airman before this. Oh. I remember this because he was just streaming. Before yesterday, but I'm not on the leaderboard. What? What? Oh yeah, because the leaderboard resets every, like, week. I could turn it into an all-time leaderboard if you want to. That's like the default Twitch thing, is that it resets every week. <laughs> God, this used to be so insane. Just a reminder, again, that before anyone else was able to do Airman, <laughs> Cookie Z FC'd it with Hard Rock. Cookie Z assessed it no mod and then FC'd it with Hard Rock. In 2013. <laughs> Did Wolf retire? Yeah, Wolf is a. Uh, Wolf is playing right now. Streaming. Right now. <laughs> right here. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> he does that like pretty much every day. <laughs> just in case you want to catch Wolf. It's chill, because he's doing completion. So he's just playing every map, so he'll play like easy diffs and normal diffs and hard diffs and stuff like that. So it's just chill to just hang out in the stream, it's nice. It's like a- it's like the Momo vibes, you know? Alright, alright. New keyword, new keyword. You ready for this? You ready? You ready? Wait, wait. Jinkala. You guys, you guys know about Jinkala? Here, hold on. Let me, let me tell you. This is, this is everything you will ever need to know about Jinkala. Okay? I want Jinkala. Every every culture is not developed. There must be Jinkala. I want the Jinkala. <laughs> this isn't the same. Wait, wait, wait. I need the the true and honest one with like subtitles. I want to hear them say it. I want to hear the voices. Jinkala. Uh, subtitles. <laughs> Epic and extremely exaggerated. Ah, uh, maybe this is the only way. Okay, okay. Wait, did you find one with subtitles? Okay, okay. Wait, no, this is the one. Does it actually have English subtitles? It doesn't have subtitles. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Guys, we need more jinkala. Here, look at this. I want jinkala. Every, every culture is not developed. There must be jinkala. I want a jinkala. Japan totally lacks in resources. There must be jinkala. True. Jinkala. 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 It's mine. It's mine. Jinkala. It's mine. Jinkala belongs to me. Don't fight. Don't fight. Want my jinkala? Tell me the benefit of kala. Okay. Fertilizer with jinkala. No loss. No ever break. Zero waste. What? Fertilizer with jinkala. We absorb the dynamic under the two meter ground. The world's fertilizer is making up. Fertilizer with Jinkala could strike twice with one package. What? Fertilizer with Jinkala, eighteen hundred tons a week per hour. Japan will no longer import grain from America. 
<laughs> what? Hey, Jack, not stupid. You would do harm to America without that big collab. Never with him. After agriculture is now developed, we have to support him. Jin Kalad for Japan? Impossible. Impossible. Fuck you, Uncle Sam. With no Jin Kalad, how could we make claim? Jin Kalad. Jin Kalad. Oh, 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 this is the best part. This is the ending. This is classic right here. What's the cursor? Look at the cursor just on the screen. American American I love that American It's so American Okay, okay yeah, guys, guys, but, but, you know, yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Im Jinkala might be a famous fertilizer for, for farming wheat. 1,800 tons or pounds or whatever. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I don't remember the talking point. But it's also the best way to farm PP. It is. How will we farm PP without Chinkala? You can sprinkle it twice, kind of true. Guys, guys. I'm not even kidding either. I I have farmed PP using Jinkala. Look. <laughs> Look. <laughs> it's true. It's true. I have farmed PP myself using Jinkala. <laughs> Look at this. It's too good. It's too good not to use. Jinkala! Jinkala! Oh yeah, Jinkala! <laughs> oh man, I'm sorry. I, I made that the keyword and I had to go on my Jinkala rant. 470 PP. Yeah, do you guys know my play? Do you guys want to watch this? <laughs> it's a pretty awesome play. Different Jinkala song. Different Jinkala. But uh, but uh. In the map link, okay. Give me some jinkalas in the chat right now, right now. Jinkala, 
Uh, this is the one. Ooh. <laughs> I am, I am. Why does this exist? What do you mean? American. 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 Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know what I've done. I don't. Here is the international spotlight. Here is the forefront of innovation. Here, the leaders of the world's 500 biggest companies. 金克拉生产基地， wow. 美国圣地亚哥国际农业集团，在这里，丛林环绕，五千名特种兵重兵把守，历届美国总统上任，必定到这里亲临拜访。Wow. 这里支撑着美国农业，引领着美国农业发展，影响着世界农业。飞得更高，走得更远。美国圣地亚哥国际农业集团总裁威廉伯爵，享有与美国总统同等的荣誉。在历届总统选举中，圣地亚哥支持谁，谁将成为最有力的总统候选人。一颗小小的原子弹，改变了整个二战的局面。一粒金灿灿的金可拉，加速了全球农业的发展。金可拉，在美国最高绝密中，与核武器同列第一。它是改变一个国家农业局面的核武器，重要意义不言而喻。金可拉。八十种天然稀缺矿物质提炼的精华，金可拉，大型电脑定位生产，三万摄氏度精密提炼，一公斤金可拉原料高达五百万美元，而每年资源提炼数量有限。金可拉，让肥料零浪费、零流失、零蒸发。金可拉，金可拉，沉积在两米下土壤中的氮磷钾。金可拉，让世界农民以最少的投入获得最大的收获。金可拉，金可拉，让六十八个国家提前五年实现了农业现代化。每天，从圣地亚哥国际农业集团三千辆专列。一千艘货轮，五百架次飞机，满载金可拉昼夜不停，发往世界一百二十九个国家。科技是推动经济发展的第一生产力。二零零七年，金可拉来到中国，将以新的高度助推中国农业展翅高飞。Wow.
American. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think we've learned a lot. We, I think we've learned a lot about Jinkula. <laughs> what can I say? What can I say? What can I say? Apart from... Woyao Jinkula. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow. I'm so glad I was able to educate so many people about a uh, Jinkala. Thoughts on this emote? What is this? Thanks for the follow. Willy, when you see it, what? Guys, do I add this? Guys, guys, do I, do I add this? Yes, yes, no. Add it, no, yes, no, yes, yes, Jinkla says so. No, yes, 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 thank you, no. Add it, yes, yes. <laughs> the American reminds me of this clip. What is this? Project talk. <laughs> <laughs> oh good. Welcome. Welcome. I like the I like the Toho project. <laughs> this is a good clip. This is a good clip. Look at this. Welcome. I'm having fun. <laughs> Why does he say it? Why does he say Toho like that? <laughs> choked, choked Uta DT? Sounds, sounds like a, uh, sounds like a fun day. Okay, it's added. 1026, no! No, you can't do that. Thank you, thank you. We're just hanging out. We're just chilling. We're just we're just watching some good videos. We're just having some good fun over here today. It's true. Ah, but the keyword is Jinkala. To review some profiles. That's my job. That's what I do. Maybe one day Twitch will respond to my partnership application and we can have the celebration that I've been planning. But until then. What is the lore behind this emote? Oh, we went over it yesterday. Should we go over it again? <laughs> that was a fun one. Look at this. Look at this. Your job is to review Jinkala, not profiles. <laughs> kind of true. Kind of true. <laughs> Everybody wants Jinkala. You weren't here yesterday? Everyone missed it. Everyone missed the, the 1026 lore. Here, here, let's watch this. I remember when this happened. This was insane. Here, here, let's get some Osu history in here. Oh my god. This video. Oh, good old days. Dude, RGB by Chippy. What a skin. This is a very 2014-2015 skin. When does he actually like start his run? Okay, like right here. Look at this. Look at this. This score was crazy. I don't even know what to, how to express. It's so hard to tell people 
who weren't there back then, like, how crazy this was. This is a score that everyone had wanted, like, forever. It was just no one could do it until then. You didn't troll, true, true. That would have been a very different play if you had trolled. You don't know this one? This is a huge moment in history. Maybe not, not huge, but this was a big score when he set this. This is big enough to get on all on a on a uh, Reddit, so. Thank you for the slatterance. It's not hard. Just read the numbers. That's it. Well, so that's not even how Rarucci played. You guys know where Rarucci played, right? Rarucci's playstyle is, is something that cannot be emulated. <laughs> I mean, it can, but no one dares try. Yeah, I don't know what, what a good comparison of this would be. Maybe like... I, mean, I don't know. Some score that, that just people have wanted to do for years. Look at that, look at that chat reaction. That's how you know that's crazy. Hi, Reddit. <laughs> yeah, this was, this was like one of the most upvoted posts on Reddit. Thank you for the Prime, by the way. Thank you for the Prime. How much would this be back then? Like 400 PP? It's nothing. I don't even know how, how it is now. That I don't, just I don't know how to how to like I I can't think of a a play that would be like equivalent now. You know what I mean? Maybe like I mean it's such a popular map. Like like what what what, what what's a what's a map? I don't know, maybe like like Black Rover. Hidden DT, like, like someone finally getting that, like Emrek finally getting that, was pretty hype, right? You gotta think, people were trying that for, for a really long time, and they were getting, you know, pretty good runs. They were getting, you know, Bs, maybe even some As on it. But to, to finally get that FC, for that to finally happen, that's something. You know, you were S rank? I mean, people have gotten S ranks, though. Uh, like, like, for this, for, for Gold Dust, nobody had gotten it. Nobody had gotten anything. Deconstruction star equivalent. I mean, I'm trying to think of a map that's kind of like, kind of like similar in style, you know. And I mean, Gold Dust is a jump map. It's like that. Why are my, why are my notifications not popping? Oh no. Reload the overlay. See what happened, guys. Why are my, why are my notifications not going through? Do I have too many notifications? Thank you again for the prime. <laughs> yeah, here, here. I was gonna show you guys because nobody, nobody plays like Ruchi does. I want a player who does. You might notice a lot of these videos look like this, right? Even if they're just recordings of them. And you might be like, why is that? Why is that? That's so strange. Right? It, they got this this weird gray background. It's because this is how Ruchi played. He would play, you know, you turn down his background dim, and he replaced all of his backgrounds with just this gray image. And he would play, and his skin would work because his follow points were black, so he would see, you know, this. And this is just how he played. It's true. Literally, literally, this is just how he played. Here, here. They cut to like the live feed like halfway through this video. There it is. I haven't seen anyone try and do this since then. There's a way of putting this keyboard. Yeah, that's true. There's an OSU program that allows you to replace speakies. Yes, exactly. And that's what he did. That's how he played. That's just how it was. I just, I want to see someone who does this again, you know? 
Dancing now, yeah. Singing now, yeah. I first saw it, I thought it was the storyboard. True, I mean, I guess. Score everyone themselves just to get number one. What a troll. This guy's this guy's such a huge troll. I always I always used to watch uh Ruruchi Impossible Map. This used to blow my mind back in the day. Even though this has been done now. I mean White Cat is, has almost FC'd this now. But this used to blow me away watching this. Look at this. This is epic. Man. Oh. 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 It's not that bad. Talk and play. So, I know I don't 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 don't have player skins like this anymore either. I need, I need more people to have skins like this. Ah. Was he like 16 years old? Yeah, something like that. He's just gaming. He's just gaming, dude. Where's Ruchi now? He's busy tweeting and playing Minecraft, as far as I'm aware. <laughs> Let's check. Let's check up on Ruchi. He tweeted today. I know he did, because I saw one of his tweets. So it's funny that you mentioned that. He did tweet. 13 hours ago, he tweeted. Exclamation. Yes. He tweets stuff often. He tweets May 18th, he tweeted human in weird font. <laughs> Robot. Human is human. Robot. <laughs> I'm a human. Okay, human. I mean, I can just bring his Twitter over. It's, he's not gonna have anything bad. You see this? There we go. Look, he's playing Minecraft. See, I told you. He's always playing Minecraft. Minecraft's fun. What's your favorite play slash FC witnessed live? I don't know. I have no idea. I could not tell you. I could tell you plays that I love looking back at, but I don't know. I can't. I don't think I can pick a favorite one live. I don't know. I don't know. Here, you know what's one that I love looking back at because it just it blew me away. Absolutely just blew me away. When Cookie Z did Magnolia, I could not even believe what I was looking at. I was like, there was no way a human being is capable of doing such a thing. This score just like like melted my mind. Like I just could not imagine such a thing being done. 2017, this was five years ago. No, like, this actually should not be possible. Show of hands, people in the chat, how many people know this play? If you know it, one. If you don't, two. Because if you don't know it, you're in for a ride. There's a few twos, okay. Alright. I can't believe people don't know this play. Alright, let's just... Sit back. You're in for a ride. Here it is. This is where the map starts. Oh. 
What a silly guy. Yeah. Oh. Now, of course, you might look at that and you might feel like, oh, that's, that's pretty hard, but it's not like the hardest thing ever. But you gotta remember, 2017. This play, I could not believe what I had just seen. I was like, I, I, was, I was just blown away completely. I was like, what just happened? That was like the craziest thing that I'd ever seen in my life. I was, that's a good question. How does the leaderboard look now? And uh, if we open the map, this is what the leaderboard looks like today. Still Cookie Z, number three from five years ago, but Flying Tuna was able to DT it three years ago, 2019. So two years after he did it. And then recently Ryuke got an okay play. And Emrek got an okay play uh, over a year ago. Still number three. I mean, yeah. Who else is going to do this? An ADT only. Rectagon, 16 months ago. Monko, 10 months ago. That's it. That's, I mean, that's it. There's no, there's nothing else. Any Nightcore only? I mean, look, you have hidden FCs in the top 50 right here. I don't think there's going to be any other DTs. <laughs> or top 100, not top 50. I forget. I get extra ones since I have OSU+. Plus. No way Monko couldn't have done this three years ago. You underestimate how hard this map is, or at least, you know, how it is. You underestimate it. No, 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 don't tell me, don't tell me. There's no way. I don't even see it. I don't even see where you see it. Where do you see it? Am I blind? What are you guys doing? What are you, you're trolling me. You're actually trolling me. Ah, oh, man. I gotta think of another one. There's so many Cookie Z plays that no one, no one ever talks about. I mean, that, that one's pretty famous. Magnolia is pretty famous, but... Why is Vax say shown up as gray in the leaderboards? Because he's in that inactive... Inactivity. Um, you guys know uh, the one... Uh... This play is stupid. How many people know this one? One if you know it, two if you don't. <laughs> this one's stupid. This one's actually stupid. Okay. About the same amount, okay. I know, right? I'm curious to know how many first time shatters Willie sees every time he asks for ones and twos. Uh, that time, one. The time before, let me check. Two. Not many. Alright, here we go. Look at this. This is the fun part. These are messed up. That is so hard to hit. Alright, here we go. That's not even the fun part. This is. Uh, 
<laughs> Look at this. Look at this leaderboard. <laughs> Look at this leaderboard. <laughs> This FKS play is messed up. He, like, entered the act on the end, but it's just so funny. Bet Woey could do the score. Yeah, I feel like Woey could do it now. It's really hard, but I feel like it's it's possible. Oh, Onigiri Freeway Tatan's diff, dude, is messed up. This diff sucks. <laughs> it's so good. This is stupid. This is like I, I feel like I should introduce this by looking at the leaderboard. Okay? Look at this leaderboard. This is another one. Look at this. Karcher two months ago. I've seen this with hidden. Two months ago. Zudinator with the eleven miss hidden hard rock play. That's the next next best hard rock play after this. This is messed up, dude. This is this score. Just look. Just look at this. Why is it so quiet? This is a very Cookie Z score. Did he get 99 with Hard Rock? That's pretty impressive. But then again, this is 2020, <laughs> which is two years ago now. Almost two and a half years. Yep. This is where it gets good. just keep watching plays like this but I think we gotta we gotta stop stalling at some point so man keep watching true but don't you guys want profile reviews don't you guys want profile reviews God, dude, I can't believe it. I'm, I'm forcing you guys to do profile reviews. Wow, isn't this shocking? No one's wanted it. The keyword is Jinkala. Type Jinkala in the chat. You could be selected. It's true. It's true. Ugh. Should I check, uh... Fellas, fellas, let's check. I am Cookie Z. What? What? <laughs> oh, I'm so hungry right now for some reason. Probably because I didn't eat. <laughs> I have not eaten today. Forward psychology? <laughs> no! No! 
No, no. Man, when will I be accepted? <laughs> when? When will this happen? Oh, she can score in Daisuke. Oh my god, dude. That score. That score. Society would have wrecked a gun. Hard Rock FC Udme Nauta. Okay, he did it with Lower Ack in like three years after Cookie Z though. Still a really good score from Rectagon though. Guys, can we, can we... Round of applause for Rectagon. Let's... That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Oh yeah, I didn't seek Hard Rock. I completely forgot. You can just keep naming Cookie Z plays that are just like... The most deranged, messed up plays you can, you can humanly think of. You could just keep naming them. You know? Pretty good, but Cookie see <laughs> True. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm not tired. I'm not tired. I swear I'm not tired. I swear to you. I swear! I'm going to break my monitor. I swear. Stop stalling. I'm not stalling. I would never be stalling. I think we all know this. He would never be stalling. Surprised no one else has HCHR symmetry second top diff? Oh, but isn't that diff like really stupid? That's what I'm saying. Usually whenever you see something that's the second top diff and no one has done it, it there's usually, there, there's either A, just underplayed because it's the second diff so it doesn't get the attention like the top diff does, or B, something is messed up. Something is horribly messed up about that difficulty. <laughs> it's true. It, it's actually true. I, the only one I can think of off the top of my head instantly, instantly, right, is... Um, oh god, what's... Oh no, what's the map called? Da -da 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 -da, top of the end. I, I will tell you, I will tell you this right now. <laughs> Okay, top diff, pretty popular, people know it. There's even there's even a Hard Rock FC from Karcher. Wow, that's pretty impressive. That's pretty crazy, right? And you can see, you know, there's people know about FC. This is an eight star map, so I understand it, right? It's almost eight stars, it's almost eight stars. Second diff, maybe a bit underplayed, right? Maybe, maybe not as many people trying it. Something's wrong with this diff. <laughs> I will tell you this right now. This is a, this is barely seven stars. Barely. Something, something isn't right with this diff. I could do this. Could you do this hard rock? No one's hard rocking this. I believe I, anyone could do this no mod. Hard rock? I'm not so sure about. <laughs> this diff is stupid. Something's wrong with this diff. I don't know what it is. It's the stream shapes. Something's wrong with it. It's just it's it's one of the ones where you you just have to play it. And you'll 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 realize. Exit this Earth's atmosphere. Guys, no. Raid is not allowed to sponsor my chat unless unless they give me money. <laughs> if they kindly Give me five dollars. <laughs> or more. Keyword more. <laughs> I know they got the money. I know they can afford it. <laughs> Roll so we can go back to watching plays. This is crazy. You guys are insane. This is the first time ever that people have wanted to watch plays instead of doing uh, profile reviews. You guys are insane. Okay, let's roll it. Cuz 15. Cuz 15. Maybe we could make a deal. Hey, I won! You did. You did. Link that profile. Link that freaking profile, bro. 
Come on, come on, you know what to do. Hand it over. This is a robbery. Dude, why do my follow alerts- why, why are alerts just not working? Have you noticed that? I haven't gotten the... The raid go through. Oh, oh, oh. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Welcome. Welcome to this chat. I hope- I hope the, uh... The stream went well. Your internet died? No! 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 Oh. Dude, my alerts are- <laughs> hold on. Stream elements dashboard. What is happening? Why are alerts just not going through? Are they like down for maintenance? Guys, I, I, I guess I have to make a sound for every single alert now. Oh, I could just recreate the alerts. Oh, that's smart. That's smart. Okay. Where, why, why am I not getting alerts? Can I like, is there a place where I can? Dude, activity feed? I'm gonna, alerts have not been happening. Wait, that's my overlay, whoops. Alerts have not been happening for 29 minutes. <laughs> Okay, that's- that's your raid, I guess. What? Give me followers as well, do it. Oh my god. Okay, well I'll, I'll have to- okay. For 29 minutes- okay, I'm gonna redo every alert now. I'm gonna redo every alert, you ready? Okay. I can catch this, I- I got this. <laughs> that's my sub sound. <laughs> oh my god, thank you guys for the subs. Thanks for a follow. 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 Beep Thanks for a follow. Thanks for a follow. Thanks for a follow. Thanks for a follow. Do that finger lock. Thanks for a follow. Thanks for a follow. I could have just played the sounds. I have the MP3s. Wait, hold on. Wait, I have these. Why didn't I just do that? Thanks for follow. <laughs> Thanks for follow. Wait, wait. I swear I have these. I have VLC. VLC. Do that finger lock. Perfect. 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 Okay, this this can be our alerts. Do that finger lock. Oh wait, wait. Here, here's here's for the subs. Wait, where is it? Where? Where? Am I blind? Am I actually blind? Wait, what's this? Is this? Thanks for the follow. Yeah. Thanks for the follow. I just have to keep replaying this. Thanks for the follow. Is anyone else followed? Okay. Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow. Thanks. For the follow. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Oh my god. I swear I have a folder. Oh, I do. I do. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Beep, beep. Okay, okay. That's a classic. Oh, wait, wait, where's the sub alert? Where's the sub alert? There we go. There we go. It's gonna be a fiesta. That's just a bonus for all my... My loyal Willy viewers. Okay, there you go. There you go. We've done it. We've done it. I think we've covered all the alerts. I don't know why alerts aren't working. Yes, dude, hide and seek is messed up. This score is messed up. Anyway, I have to do a profile review. I don't know about you guys. I have to look at a profile and freaking review it, bro. Okay, let's do that. Climber. Good name. Interesting name. I like the username. I'm, 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 I'm with it. I like it. I like it. I'm about this. Okay. Player since August 2020. Hey, two years. Two years. Almost two years. You're about to celebrate two years, and you've dumped in almost two years worth of playtime. So hey, hope you're enjoying the game. Is it fun? You liking the game? You hating the game? You hate it? It's the worst game. You despise it? Really? Guys, one in the chat 
if you think Osu is a good game. Two in the chat if you think Osu is a great game. Three in the chat if Osu is your favorite game. Four in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> True. True. Osu's alright, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Uh, four in the chat of Osu's just okay. Osu's great, but probs not the best? No way. No way. Man. Anyway, sorry, sorry, cuz 15. One. Okay, so Osu's Osu's a great game. That's what you're saying. That's what you're saying. Rank score? Okay, man. I'll take it. It's it's okay. I'll 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 take what I can get, right? Not a lot of rank score though, so you playing shorter maps, you playing a lot of the same maps. It's kind of low. It's kind of low. I'm just saying. Hit accuracy, very good. 98.19%. That gets a thumbs up from me, you know? Hey, hey, you keep that accuracy that high, I'm going to be happy. I'm uh, I'm going to be happy. That that's your incentive. Make me happy, not make you happy. <laughs> it's all about what I think, right? 52k play count with 8.3 million total hits does bring you to the lower side of average for hits per play. So of course you know our recommendations. Try not to retry spam. It's a bad habit. Everyone does it, right? It happens. It just it it happens. All right. But we don't want it to happen. We don't want to do it because we don't want to uh, build bad muscle memory on patterns. We don't want to mind block ourselves on certain things, okay? So, uh, uh, the best thing that you can do is limit yourself. Keep yourself to say, you know, maybe three plays in a session. I keep myself at five because I just like playing maps a little bit more, right? And once all those numbers tick down, once you have no tries left, you just say, okay, I'll play that next week. Move on to a different map, practice different skill sets. Maybe even while you're playing these, right? And you're, you're also playing each of these other maps for only five tries, right? You're, you're going to start, you know, playing maps that you find hard. You're going to gain skill in the time that you would have been using just playing the exact same map, playing the exact same patterns 50 times in a row, right? In that time, you get to practice 10 different maps rather than just one. So it's quite a good thing to do. And eventually, right, especially if you're practicing and gaining skill during that time, it's going to be easier to FC that original map that you were going for along with all the other maps, you know, as you keep going because skill, you, you just gain it. You keep gaining. Okay. That's my, my method at least. And of course, try to play maps all the way through start to finish. That is the other recommendation, right? Because it helps you gain consistency, a lot of consistency, right? Playing maps all the way through, it might be tempting to quit out whenever you miss, whenever you slide a brick, especially if you're going for FCs, right? You're like, oh man, I'm wasting time if I'm not retrying, right? But you're not, you're not, because playing maps all the way through gets you to practice all the patterns in a map equally, okay? You get to play through the entire map and especially the ending, right? If you're retrying, you're not getting to the ending that often. Uh, which often nowadays has the hardest patterns of the entire map. Then what are you practicing? Oh, I think all the guys, I think all the notifications are about to happen. I, I think Twitch just caught up with real time. I think all the notifications are about to happen. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh man. All right, so yeah, keep those in mind whenever you're playing, do things like that. Max combo 1919, I have no idea. I have no idea. Your max combo is too low for me to guess. So if you want to tell us, feel free. I'll be waiting. I, I need to know. I need to know. I need to add it to my bank of combos that I have to remember. 1919, that seems like such an even like number. Or I mean, it's a palindrome, right? Kind of. It's it's like a backwards balance. <laughs> it's just two numbers that are the same, okay? Claris Song Scum. I haven't heard anybody play that in years. Oh my god. That's a unique one. That is a very unique one. Wow. Okay, that's impressive. Yeah, that's true. You're, you're, you're pretty close to the metal. Okay? He's not 10 combos away. He's more like, you know... 81 combos away from the metal. But, you know, you know... Hey... You play it, you game. You can get a 2,000 combo achievement. That is to also say, maybe you should start playing some longer maps if you're not really used to that. You know, it takes time. It, it takes 
focus to, to be able to play longer and longer maps. And if you haven't built that up yet, then that's that's something you gotta, you gotta work on, right? I'm not saying go straight out and play 10 minute long maps, right? I'm just saying work into your, your normal routine, maybe, you know, three to, to, to four more, three to four, two to three minute maps or, or three to four minute maps, something like that, really. Get yourself, get yourself out there, get yourself gaming, you know what I mean? Anyway, lots of S ranks. This is what we like to see, we generally like to see. All these added up about equal to or higher than your A's, which they are, right? Or about equal to, uh, maybe even higher if you count these, right? I was just adding these together and I was like, oh, that's pretty close. That's pretty solid. No, they're just short. Really? Really? The notifications are just gonna, they're just gonna pop randomly. All right, all right. I can deal with this. I can deal with this. Just wait for the next one. It's, it's gonna, like... Oh my god. Anyway, anyway. Yeah. Dude, I'm t what is wrong with me? I'm tired, I'm hungry. Oh my god, dude. I should have had a meal before the stream. What's wrong with me? And good stuff. This shows, you know, consistency, at least on some level, that's something you want to have, right? Consistency, your ability to perform on demand. Most people think about it in terms of FCing, right? Think about, you know, a player who's playing like seven and a half star maps and getting a couple misses. Maybe they should be able to uh, to FC five star maps, right? At least you would think so, or four star maps. And if they're not, then that's a huge consistency issue with uh, with their gameplay. <laughs> it doesn't end. It doesn't end. <laughs> Wait, why is it only subs? That's out of order. It hasn't been getting any of the follows. Wait. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so distracted. My top play is Xane. Who cares? Bro, Xane is like my number three play. It doesn't matter. Everyone knows it's a broken map. Do the finger lock. I'd kinda hoped for some willy finger lock. <laughs> Nobody cares, dude. Everyone knows the map's broken, so why should you why should that matter to you? Seriously, look. Look, you think I care? It's right here. I just know it's gonna get fixed, so I don't I don't mind. Also, people shouldn't mind having farm maps in their top plays anyway. It's like you know it's farm. Of course it's gonna end up in your top plays. Why should you care? It doesn't make you any less of a player. <laughs> wow, thank you for the raid. If you care, then why play it? Because you gotta practice maps. If you here's a little tale, okay? If you don't play farm maps, you're gonna get bad. It's true, because there's a, a type of, of skill set that is uh, expressly uh, uh, expressed so through all. modern day farm maps, okay? Right? And he, let me tell you the story. I didn't play farm maps for a long time, right? I was just like, I'm fed up with PP. I don't want to play modern day farm maps or, or play any of these, these jumpy farm maps, right? And guess what happened? I got really bad at jumps. My aim is still terrible to this day because Thanks I don't play farm maps as often. I still try to now, but... Because I avoided that specific, you know, type of map because it was like, oh, that gives way too much PP. I ended up just being bad. It's true. You can't avoid any type of map in this game. You might look at a farm map and be like, oh, but it's a farm. No, if you want to get good, you have to play farm maps. It's just a fact of life. And don't care what your, what your top plays are. It, it literally doesn't matter. PP doesn't matter anyway. PP means nothing. You know what this number boat. means on your profile? You know what this number means? It means how much you farmed compared to everyone else in the world. That's all it means. That's what your ranking is. Okay? But people act like it means like, oh, this is my skill. This means how good I am. It doesn't. It so and everyone who's who's played this game for, for a while knows that that's not your skill level. Right? Okay? Deep down inside, you might feel like, like you, you know, outwardly, you might even know like, oh, yeah, you, you know, so that's... Follow. That's that's just a number. It means nothing, right? But deep down inside, if you're still feeling like, oh, but but I mean, the number does kind of mean something. No, rethink, rethink everything. Think, so think to yourself why you feel this way, and then realize it means nothing. I mean, Xane played his first try, and I thought I would never so FC follow. because it was close to seven stars. But I found out later it was super easy. Okay, I don't see why why be you know ashamed of that at all you know that it's, it's an follow. issue with the pp system so why care 
PP doesn't matter anyway. This is this is the biggest lesson to anyone. If you care about PP, you are holding yourself back from actually trying to gain skill. You can gain skill while still caring about PP, and you can have it be like like a like a, a side quest, right? PP, just just think on the side, right? Think your main goal should be improving at the game, and on the side to be like, oh, maybe I should try and get some high PP plays, but. It's, it, by and large, right, people focus on, on farm maps the and they end up playing maps, right? And then they feel bad that they have, you know, these farm maps in their top plays and they end up feeling bad because they'll play a, a, a map that's... that's the follow. How, here, here, let me, let me ask you, chat. How do maps become farm? I, I, there's a very specific answer Fakes I'm looking for. How do you, how do people, why do people consider certain maps farm? Everyone plays them, everyone farms them. Okay, but why does everyone the play follow. them? Why does everyone farm them? PP, okay, you're getting close, you're getting close. They take less effort. Okay, you're you're almost Fakes there. The you're follow. almost there. You are so close to being there. Overweighted, yes, yes. Gives more PP for the actual difficulty. Yes, you, that you are you're like about to hit the nail right on the head. You were about to hit the nail right on the head. You're so close. Thanks for the follow. Let me tell you. You ready? Here's the answer that I was looking for. You ready? Because you were so close. So you were like, a, completely like adjacent Thanks to that. Follow. Like right next to it. You ready? It's because it tricks the the star rating system into being higher star rating than the map Thanks actually the is in reality, right? The patterns are easier, but the, the star rating system doesn't know that. So it gives it, you know, instead of being 5.8 stars, it's, it's now six stars. You know, you get what I'm saying? And then as a consequence, that's what follows is PP is higher on those maps, even though it feels like it shouldn't be and, and, and everything else, right? That's what makes maps farm, right? Is that they're, they're easier uh, uh, than they appear, at least in terms of star rating. Makes sense? So here's what happens to a lot of, of people who, who focus only on farming, right? Is they'll play stuff and they'll be playing these, these like, you know, let's just say, oh, they, they start playing, you know, uh, uh, 6.5 star farm maps, right? Now, as, as the, the viewers now that we've established this, we know that the star rating isn't actually 6.5 stars. It's probably, for a lot of the farm maps, closer to something like maybe 6.2 stars, maybe 6.1, right? On a lot of those maps, right? So they'll they'll get used to playing these six point five star maps, and then they'll go to play a more like like normal six point five star map that doesn't have the the farm patterns that boost the star rating, and then they'll do horrible, and then they'll feel bad, and they'll be like, what? Why am I doing bad? Right? I can FC, you know, a six a six point you know wh whatever star map or a seven star map, but I can't FC this random six point three star map, you know. And they feel bad, and then you feel terrible about yourself. But you got to realize it's because you're playing stuff where the star rating just isn't right to begin with. Star rating means nothing. It literally means nothing. Solution: just play tech maps. It's true. So that's don't feel bad about farm maps. That's to say, that, that's a huge. Here we can talk more about this after the profile review. I'm sorry, I, I, I got stun locked by this, but Thanks for the follow I, I was I was reading a, a chat messages. So climber, climber, what's up? What's up? How are you doing? Talk to me again. Cuz 15. Uh, yeah, so so I was saying, right? It's good to have this. We can keep... That's why you don't judge maps by SR. Exactly. But then even the same people who don't judge it by SR, right? Because they know, oh, tech maps are hard, so the star rating is higher. They'll still think that about farm maps. So it's a lot of people will, will think about these things not deeply enough. You know what I think? You know what I mean? And then they'll, they'll wonder, like, what's going on. So it, it's you, you got to think. You got to think all the way on this. It's not just, you know, uh, tech maps that are that are starred wrong, right? If, if there's one thing that's starred wrong, probably most stuff is starred wrong. That's what you got to think. That's what you got. Then you got to start getting your brain to think, like, oh, well, then what, what, does, what does this do to the PP system? And it completely breaks the PP system and it ruins it. Because, you know, you're going to have plays that are inaccurate, you know, in one regard or another. And you, you guys probably know that all your top plays. I'm sure that you guys have your your best play that, you, that you've ever done. Probably half of you, it's not your top play. Maybe even more. Can I see? Can I can I see in chat here? Here, throw me throw me a a, a one in chat if your best play is your top play. 
A two in chat otherwise. Oh man, I'm seeing a lot more twos than I expected. It's usually half and half, because sometimes you play a map and it's so hard that it just becomes your top play. Okay, the ones are evening it out. See, and that's how it is. And here, here maybe, maybe that's not how it is currently. Has anybody ever in the past had it so like, oh, you're like, oh, well, my best play isn't my top play, right? Because, you know, sometimes you go through through cycles. You go, you go through like, you set a new top play and you're like, oh, this is my good one, right? But then, you know, next week, oh, a farm map comes out and suddenly, you know, that's your new top play. It's something to think about. It's something to think about, okay? Anyway, sorry, uh, so go for consistency, right? You, you've been going for it pretty good. Uh, but that's not to say that getting A's is bad, right? Pushing your own skill cap, pushing your own limits is what's more important in terms of improvement, right? Playing maps that you find hard, playing maps that you can't quite aim, that you can't quite tap, where you're getting misses, dropping accuracy, that's good, right? Getting these B's, getting these A's are huge for your improvement because you are pushing your own limits. And make sure that you are always pushing your limits, going outside of your comfort zone, okay? And, and you know, trying to improve, effectively trying to improve. It's true. Because for the longest time, right, I focused on a lot on just FCing maps and getting high accuracy. I was like, that is my grind, that is my challenge, right? And things like that. And I wasn't pushing my skill cap hard enough. I wasn't actually, you know, playing maps that I found hard. I was playing maps that I could FC with 99% accuracy. And guess what? I wasn't improving and then I wondered why I wasn't improving. It's the answer right there. I wasn't playing maps that I found hard. I wasn't playing maps, you know, outside of anything that I could uh, get, you know, 99% on. So of course I wasn't improving. I wasn't improving my tapping. I wasn't improving my aiming or anything like that. I still was improving like minuscule, right? Like slowly you will, you will improve, but not at all like at the same type of improvement where you actually just push your own limits. It's true. So let's take a look. You have some pin plays. Oh, oh, speedy. Got a little little speedy guy right here. <laughs> oh, 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 this one's cool. This one might be my favorite play here. Oh, but Marissa Quest is so fun. Dude, I love Marissa Quest. Oh, this map's awesome. Okay. Oh, I, I'm debating which one I like more. Oof. Oh, dude, I don't know. I don't know, actually. I might go with Marissa Quest. That might be my favorite just because of the act. That's solid. You got some bangers right there. Oh my god, this map sucks. I hate this map. It took me like a, like years to FC this map. It took me forever to FC this map. That's why I hate it. I love it. It's a pretty good map, honestly. That map is so hard. It is. It is. Ugh. Ugh. I love Marissa Quest. Good, good. That's a pretty solid play. I like that. I like that. Still, you know, even with the tapping, even with the, the, you know, stamina, speed, and stuff like that, you're still getting some aim plays in here, which is good to see. Lots of DT, lots of higher AR, so uh, uh, a thing that I might notice immediately, make sure your reading is, is okay, right? When you're only playing higher AR, it, the worry might be that you're you're more focused on, on reacting rather than reading, but reading can boost uh, 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 your, your, I mean, uh, effectively how you understand patterns. That is what reading is. If you get a lot better at reading, right, whether it be from playing low AR or whatever else, you, you'll improve just overall, right? A lot of people don't understand that. Learning how to process patterns, break down patterns at lower AR will help you at higher AR because you don't have to do the work, right? Once you get to like high, high AR, a good portion of it becomes reaction, right? It becomes a lot more reaction focused, but there's still a good chunk that's reading, processing patterns and understanding and being able to break down the patterns that you're seeing. Or at least making, forming relations between the patterns so they're not just notes. You know what I mean? Reading makes every other skill better, right? Including high AR. People think people always think about reading in a low AR context. They're always like, "Oh, well, why would I need to learn to read AR eight, right? I'm not gonna play AR eight maps, but it improves everything. It improves every aspect. So that might be something to work on. And it doesn't just have to be AR eight, right? It could be. Uh, it, it's all about the density, right? And getting your brain used to to like on the fly breaking down patterns, seeing patterns, and just just like chunking them. You know what I mean? So, 
one of the things to to think about immediately, right, is like maybe I should be playing maps that are AR9 flat, but at like 220 BPM. That's really hard. That's really hard. It's a lot harder than you might expect. And there's there's not a ton of them, but stuff like that. You might want to do that. So if it's something you're not used to, right, that's something you're going to. Of course, bringing down the AR makes it makes it better. AR9 at 220 is painful. It is. It is. But it will teach you a lesson. It will teach you a lesson. It's a true fact. Still, keep getting faster. Keep grinding speed because you're you're getting some crazy fast plays, at least right now. Uh, uh, speed and uh, finger control go hand in hand. So think about, you know, as you're, 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 you're uh, uh, shredding, right? Make sure that you're, you're also going to get some finger control as well and being able to, uh, to act a lot of these patterns because you know, you're almost there. You're almost there. For a lot of speed maps, especially with, with like higher OD, lower accuracies are more acceptable because the OD is just like so high. But, you know, generally on most plays, just generic most plays that you're ever going to see, I'd say like average ACK is 97, good ACK is 98, really, really insane ACK is 99, right? So keep those baselines in mind whenever you're thinking of this. And, you know, uh, some of these are, are some older plays as well, right? Like this was a month ago. If you've improved at tapping, if you've improved that finger control, maybe you can go back and fix the accuracy on, on this play and see if you can do better. Who knows? Who knows? I mean, this one was three months ago, so maybe your speed is even better now than it was before and you're able to do that. Uh... Yeah, like we said, lots of DT. Still some aim in here, which is good, right? You want to be good at aim. You don't just want to focus on tapping. Uh, not not a lot of other mods. There is some hidden, and then it looks like it's it's mainly on a, a very simple rhythm jump map, right? Which is probably the easiest thing to throw mods on. You could throw uh, on, on a, a map that has, you know, no rhythm, just jumps. You could pretty much just throw, you know, hidden, DT, <laughs> hard rock, <laughs> maybe even all of them. It'll be not as hard as as a map with with more complex patterns right uh, don't get me wrong it'll still be hard but it's just not as hard so if you could throw uh hidden on some more well-rounded maps maybe i don't know this maybe let me think oh maybe even just caliburn of the the legendary sword that would be a really good hidden play if you could throw that on that or you know hard rock i uh, it's hard for a lot of people to get into hard rock but i think it could teach you something about finger control and, and a lot of other stuff i think it's good to just be good at everything haven't really played other mods you should you should i think you should it'd, it'd be good hard rock is really tough for people to get into it if they haven't played it before because you start out you already have the higher ar right which i mean you seem pretty used to to you know ar 9.6 maybe even ar 10 maybe 10.3 on some of these plays right so i don't think that'll be a super big issue but the issues for other people are of course you know smaller circles if you're playing something at cs5 plus hard rock it becomes cs 6.5 which if you're not used to that if you're not into that before that that can be quite jarring your first time but also probably the biggest thing overall the hit window because it makes most maps that you're going to be playing OD10, right? Which is, apart from, from OD10 plus DT, right? The highest non-DT uh, OD that you can reach in the game. So the, the hit window is super tight. You have to time your hits very accurately, right? And it, it can be frustrating at first learning it because, because of that fact. And, you know, all the other stuff compounding on it. It took me years to get used to Hard Rock OD10. Hard Rock has the highest learning curve. Maybe so, maybe so. But what I found was that helped me get into Hard Rock a, a lot easier was I would just play maps that I was already familiar with, right? Like Seven Doors, maybe you you know this map. You have seen it with 99% accuracy. You probably know the patterns. You know the rhythm, right? If not, then think of just a, a map that you might know better. I'm just no, using this as an example. I would throw a Hard Rock on a map I knew, where I knew the patterns, where I knew, you know, the rhythms and stuff. It, and also Hidden. I, I did this with Hidden as well because it works for Hidden. And I would uh, see it. I would observe the map as I'm playing it. And since I knew the rhythms, I'd be like, okay, this rhythm's coming up or this pattern's coming up and this and this, right? And it would help me make the connection in my mind to how I'm supposed to be playing it. You know what I mean? It's a lot easier to, to play something when you, you already have an idea of like the patterns that are going to happen rather than just sight reading with Hard Rock, which is going to be like impossibly hard to start out on, right? Hard work is definitely fun to play. It makes some maps that couldn't do before doable. Oh, interesting. I, w I was going to say, Hard Rock is basically just a harder no mod. That's the way that you could see. Thanks for the follow. You know, it, it really puts you to the test, you know? Gekka Jasmine. 
I'm not sure if I know that one. Hey, look, it's my favorite map. But yeah, good stuff. Ooh, ooh, that's spicy. And of course, some of these older plays, right, you can always go back and fix them. It's not like you only get one play on this map ever and it's done, right? I I'm sure that a lot of these you just forget about. I mean, this is over a month old, right? This is over a month old. You know, this one was more than a year ago. I'm sure you could do this now. If you fixed up this play, not only would you, I mean, uh, not only would you uh, just get a better play, but also, um, it's just a little secret, just a little secret. Um, if you were more PP oriented, and I know that there's a lot of PP oriented chat people in the chat, fixing your accuracy and FCing plays gets you so much PP, literally so much. That and filling out your top plays. I, I will just tell you this right now, right? Like, like you might think like, oh, I missed at the very ending. It doesn't really matter. I mean, it, it kind of does, right? This is 202 PP, 97.33%. Okay, six one hundred. Let's just assume that you get like one less 100, right? And maybe not the 50, okay, okay. Okay, you see this? You see this? It's 261 PP. Maybe you did get like the 50 though. Here, maybe you did get the exact same act, but just without misses. That's still 247 PP. That's so much PP. <laughs> Guys, that would be, that would be here or here in your top place. That would be nearing your top 10 in your top place for something that's like number 70 right now or something. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying, Ack is worth so much. It is, because, I mean, at the end of the day, this is a rhythm game. And if you're getting accuracy on something like that, which is already, you know, OD8 almost, right? So with DT, that's almost OD9.7, almost, not quite, because it's 7.9. So it's probably like OD6, or 8, 9.6. <laughs> oh my God. It's at 21 UTC? Yeah, sure. I definitely will. Yeah, I, in fact, whenever he starts, I think I'll just raid. Does that sound good? Is that 21 UTC? Oh, I would have to keep streaming for hours and hours. Maybe I should go get food. Do you think that would be fun? If I if I just threw on like one of my history videos for 20 minutes and I went and I got food. <laughs> do you think I should do that? <laughs> Dude, I'm hungry. I didn't get, I usually get food before stream because it's like lunchtime for me when I start stream. But I didn't get anything, and now I'm like starving. <laughs> I'm just thinking about about food. Tomorrow's at U 18 UTC, yeah. Uh, I, I should say to everyone watching, I won't be streaming tomorrow or Sunday. I'll be back on Monday. Just because I know that, that there's going to be the BTMC tournament and also uh, Charlie's Perfect Math class, so... I don't really want to compete with them. And I also kind of want to watch. I think it's going to be a fun experience. So I do want to watch those. Don't worry. We'll be back. We'll be back and better than ever on Monday. It's true. You watching the round table? We, we were just... We... <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, so that is to say, if you guys want to watch along, if you guys want to hang out, you know, while we watch this, uh, join the Willy Osu Discord server, discord.gg slash Willy. Oh, you have delay? No, it's fine. It's fine. I know. I was just, it's just funny. The timing, whatever that happens, is just very funny because I was like, I was just like, oh yeah, I'm going to be, uh, you know, watching the round table and Charlie's Perfect Math class. And then the message pops where it's like, oh yeah, are you watching the round table? <laughs> Here you go. Look at that. Look at that. That's so epic. Discord.gg slash Willy. Join. Especially if you're a sub, you get access to the secret sub channel. So, just saying. Just saying. You can also yell at other people watching the tournament. That's kind of true. That's kind of true. So, <coughs> so, yeah. Right? You can always go back, fix some of your plays, get something like that. That would be awesome. You got this. You can game. Trust me. So moving on to medals, they're like achievements in other games. You ever got a Steam achievement or a game and you're like, oh, that's kind of fun. I used to be an achievement hunter on Steam. I think I I 100 percented Portal. I know that. I think I got close to Portal 2. I used to try and go for every single achievement I could. I think I did it for like a good portion of the the Valve games I used to have. Like I have I have a ton of Gary's mod achievements in TF2 because I would go for those. Oh TF2. I want to play TF2. It's true. Do drop slide rants. 
uh, oftentimes, a lot of these achievements will, will rely on you getting perfect combo instead of just FC. So, so whenever you see FC mentioned in, in you know, like Osakai or something, they usually mean perfect combo. I did not see any tweets tell me. Unless there's like some circumstance. Anyway, so if you're ever bored, you can game, you can play for some medals, you can have some fun. Never mind then. What? I want to see this. I want to look this up now. I'm looking this up on Twitter. Okay, I don't know what to look at. I didn't think this through. <laughs> I didn't think this through. I don't know what to, what to find. Anyway, they give you a different way to play. Just like I said, you know, you can get burnt out from PP. PP farming can be, you know, hugely detrimental to your mental, right? And stuff like that. So if you ever need a side quest, right? There's stuff like rank score farming. You know, you could try and farm as many SS's or, or S's as you want. You could try and farm top 50 leaderboard positions on maps, right? Or you could play for medals. I'm like 98% certain it doesn't exist. Interesting, interesting. It's always fun to do. Peaking at 3.8 thousand plays in a single month. What are you doing? That's so much retry spamming. Every now and then metal farming is fun. It is, it is. I think a good portion of like the, the early on hush hush metals are really fun to get. Then they get really hard. Like once you start nearing the bottom. But there's a lot of really fun hush hushes. Want to leaderboard farm? I mean, you can right now. Even even in your current state, you can leaderboard farm. It's true. This is this is good willy lore. When I started the game, I was like, I want to get a bunch of leaderboard positions. So you know what I did? Can you guess what I played? And it worked. And I got a ton of leaderboards. Here, I want to see if anyone can guess it. This is a good answer. This is a good answer. Nearly ranked maps? Uh, kind of? Bingo, you guys got it. Three modding, easy, and normal diffs. Not even a flashlight, I would just three mod easy and normal diffs, and I got a ton of top 50s that way. It's true. It's true. Now Nowadays, there's a, there's a lot more. There's a lot of stuff, but it works. It works. That's how I got my start, uh, leaderboard farming. And of course, from there, you can go into like, uh, maybe since you're since you're kind of speedy you could probably double time like hard diffs right like i don't know if you've tried this i mean i i'm i'm deep into the, the thing but hard diffs are they they usually only have like triples or, or like one burst or something in it so you could you could just as long as you can do that and you can hit the rest of the notes they're they're doable to get really high positions on some of them are are much easier so they look like this but some of them are, are a bit harder so they might be more uh more uh, apt for leaderboards. Definitely not farm maps though. These are so easy that everyone's done them, right? You know what I mean? Like like really fast hard diffs. Like like any map hard diffs. Like you gotta think like oh, God, I can't think of like like just a normal song. Like I don't know, Tsukinami if it had a hard diff. I don't think it does. You know what I mean? Like that's really fast. You could do it, you could get it. That's a that's a free top 50 right there if you can do it. I mean, if you can get really good ack. See, and that's more incentive for you to grind finger control and stuff like that, right? To get the ack to be able to get top 50 positions. <laughs> anyway, you've played a good amount of maps, a pretty solid amount of maps, over 5,000, right? But I'm always gonna say to everyone, download more. Experience more maps, experience different types of patterns, different types of maps that you might not be used to if you haven't played tech maps, right? Then you gotta play some to learn how to how to hit the patterns and then maybe that'll be, you know, a new type of map that you can start grinding. Just uh, as an example. <laughs> what? <laughs> this guy seems a little angry in the chat. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what happened. He seems a little angry in the chat. Oh! <laughs> KHC is back. How was the Osu session? How how was the <laughs> the like ten minute long Osu session? Welcome Raiders. <laughs> we are finishing up this profile review, which I mean we pretty much are at the end. So do you have any questions or anything else you want us to look at, Climber? I think you're in a good spot. I think uh, work on reading will probably be one of the biggest things. Streamed in 15 FPS. <laughs> so it looked like an old Keenan stream, right? <laughs> 
It looked like a. It looked like a. <laughs> I can't think of any other score from back in the day. No questions, really. Oh my god. Kinan Osu. Thanks for the follow. You and me. Oh my god, I can't even find old Keenan clips. This sucks. I want like ancient era Keenan clips and I can't even find any. Well, if you have no questions, you can always come back if you think of something, right? I always try and field and answer questions from the chat whenever I get them. If anybody ever has a question about gameplay. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here's peak, peak Keenan right here. You see this? You see this? Here we go. This is what your stream should look like. Because it's so long, and Some old style. That's my turn. Yeah, I like the, the squished face scan. <laughs> oh, man. Weren't you streaming like two minutes ago? Yep, he was. <laughs> The broken MP, you're right. <laughs> I used to play this map so much, dude. Nope. Look at that. That's huge. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it live. I saw that gameplay live. A my elegy dt dat combo. Now this is awesome. Oh, this is even better. Guys, this is what your stream should have looked like. Wow. This is awesome. This is awesome. I haven't seen Kid in a while. He streams. You can check him out on Twitch still. He tries to stream. He's got new internet recently. Okay. Okay. Have fun with that. Have fun with that, Killer Hurts. Holy shit. The mic. <laughs> this is awesome. I still like this. Has anyone DTF seen this? I have no idea. different era i love that i love watching stuff from there i remember this this play was crazy this play is crazy look at this he, he reaches the end he's like what bpm was that there's no way that was 300 bpm you know or something like that No, that's what he says. He's like, that can't be tree 20 tree. <laughs> that's what he says. That can't be tree 23, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> I love this overlay. This is his best overlay. Look at this. Osu player, top 50 in the world. So here's some Keenan lore for people who don't know. So he had this overlay forever that said top 50 in the world. And then he got knocked out of the top 50. So... <laughs> Is this just a replay or is this... It's triples! Triples! 
so he got knocked out of the top 50. So he had the update his overlay. So you just put a black box on it and wrote 52. <laughs> That's awesome. Literally so awesome. <laughs> Tell me that's not like the best thing ever. <laughs> Simply genius? It really is. It really is smart. Oh. I forget. I forget what else. Hey. Max Love, see. All the things she said to teach her. God, there's some bangers back here. Universe Page, I love this map. I love this map. Dash Hopes 3 new act record. Oh my god. Dude, I used to watch these so often. Look at this. That's why he says act record because it's not an FC. God. It's pretty fast back then, dude. There's no character in overlays now. It's fun though. Oh. There's no character in my overlay because I think overlays suck. I did like a 180. My favorite time streaming was when was when I, I had basically no overlay. Here, here, look at this. Look at this. You go back just a little bit. I, I used to like try and over engineer like these crazy overlays. I was like, okay, maybe I just need like the webcam like like thing. Y you know what I mean? And stuff like that. And that you, you can see like all the way back here. I had like these these like really stupid looking overlays. What, I was sitting too early first. So let me right? Like, like we're, we're just like Willy. Right? They need to know it's Willy. Or, or like maybe, maybe I'll use, you know, my logo. You can... I don't know if you can see that at the bottom. Like, I tried to over-engineer these, and then I was just like, you know what? This is just stupid. Why don't I just, like, like just just throw my, my, my webcams in the bottom right corner? The most pure Osu overlay that you can't use is no overlay. It's so good. It's legitimately just so good. This is how Osu gameplay should look. Do you see this play if you haven't already? I already have. We watched it at the start of the play. Start of the play. Started the stream, but I can again. I used to think that overlays make streams look like cheap TV news stations. I'm I'm now of the opinion that just like I don't know, it, it, it gives you, it gives you, not like, I don't even want to say like, it gives you, you credibility or, or, or anything like that, right? It's just like, it's just being honest, you know? Because you know I'm not like some crazy streamer or anything, I'm just some dude. I just press go live for my button that I, I look at people's profiles, you know? That's it. I'm not like, like a, a million dollar streamer or anything. I'm just being honest, you know? Overlays are okay if they don't make the gameplay smaller. Uh, okay. I used to have overlays that made the gameplay smaller because my internet couldn't take it. Anyway, sorry, sir. Let's watch this play again, because why not? This play is just stupid. Isn't that what million dollar streamers do? That's true! That's true! That's actually true! And then, you look at the actual million dollar streamers, and guess what? Guess what? You look at you look at here here. XQC is streaming right now. He's he's like the actual you know he's making like like a two billion dollars a month or something, right? Let's look at it. Let's look at his stream. Let's see what overlay he's using. I don't even really think people outside of the Osu Thanks community the use overlays, apart from like like a little box around their webcam. That's like the streamer thing is doing a box around your webcam. Osu feels like the only game I've ever seen where people actually use overlays. You know what I mean? I don't think I've ever seen that outside of Osu. Have you guys? Like not counting boxer on webcam. Speedrunners? Oh, I guess that's true. Okay, I wasn't thinking about speedrunners. I was thinking more about just people who play like, like I don't know, CS or something. Yeah, look at this. Look at this. Look at this overlay. You like this? <laughs> Million dollar streaming setup right here. Good overlays. 
I've seen Osu streamers turn off their overlays when they play a different game. Like, why, though? He had an overlay? Really? Really? Wait, wait. Can, can someone find that? I want to see that overlay. Yeah, that but, like, hard. this. There's just so much going on in screen, which I kind of like. I, I kind of like this one. This was a different era. This isn't... This isn't the real universe page. What is this? Best of old XQC clips. Okay, let's see the overlay. Yeah! What? I don't, I don't see the overlay. Here, I want to see the full stream. That, again, this is just like a webcam box. But I, okay, I guess I do see chat, right? Like so that. Wait, what's this? Wait, is that like game chat? And then this is chat? Wait, okay, now I'm confused. <laughs> if I could just see like the actual stuff. Because I feel like this is just a webcam box, right? This is just a box around your webcam. Okay, so maybe there was an overlay. Okay. I just, I don't remember people like using overlays outside of the Osu community. I really don't. I think it's it's a very unique thing to the Osu community. At least the way that overlays are, are so pervasive, even to this day. Everyone using overlays. I mean, let's, let's go to the Osu category. Let's see what's going on, right? Of course, show matches, so that's definitely an overlay. Overlay right here. Overlay right here. Overlay right here. 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 You know? Here. I don't see this. I don't, I don't know what he's showing off. It's just, it's it's like, there's still, there's still so many. A lot of Smash players. Overlays just suck? Eh, I, I don't know. I think they can be done well if they're cool. Like, I feel like I could make an okay looking overlay. You know? But I just, I don't really want to. I don't really want to. I like I like how my overlay is right now, which is none. It's just a, a box around my webcam. I also like this. I like this. You might notice. You see how my box is like space around the edges. I don't like when it's it's clumped into the edge, right? Like like. You know you know how uh, some of them they it's literally just a box in the corner. I don't know. I that looks so flat to me. I like I like this. You see that? To the part the, to the the point where I've engineered this box to have edges around it so i can just snap it like this or this to whatever side of the screen i need isn't that smart i've, I've thought this through i've made my my thing so easy to use and so good now because now it's just a folder I, I i now know how to actually properly use obs for the first time ever look and stream elements makes everything so easy it's just an overlay it's just look i turn this off that that has my chat, my alerts. It has the the sub goal. It, you could add like like a million different things on the overlay. Like actually, it's all just free. It's all just free. And then look, I got my Osu full screen capture, my game capture, just in case I need like a full screen application. But I could also use, just use my display capture. Why why when I click on when I click on display, it just like pulses. You see that? It's crazy. I think Osu Stream Companion overlays are the best. I just don't want to set up Osu Stream Companion. I've never liked it. I don't want to set it up. I don't care. I just don't want to. I just don't. I, I Back important. in the old days, I saw people who were like, oh yeah, you should set up Stream Companion to make your stream look so cool. Right? Are you still doing some profile views? Probably. I, I was thinking about getting some food really quick. So would you guys still stick around if I just went and got food for like 15 minutes? I, I'll throw a video on. I'll throw like one of my my history videos on. You guys can watch that. No, no. Okay, fine. I'll just starve. I'll just starve to death. Fine. We'll just sit here. We'll just sit here. I'll I'll just starve. <laughs> Take us with you. I can't. I literally can't. What What do you want me to do? Order me food and I'll eat it for you cooking stream what do i have to cook i don't have food 
I, you, you found the issue here. I don't have food. <laughs> I'm telling you, I need to go get some food. Food check? Food check? Thanks for the follow. Oh my god. Yeah, but if I do this, then I'll be able to go for like another two hours afterwards. Which is longer than we usually go for. So then you'll be prepared. Does that sound good? That sound fun? That sound epic? That sound crazy? Trust me, trust me, it's gonna be worth it. I, I want to try it out. I want to see. Here, here. Chat, you you better yeah. keep yourselves entertained. You ready for this? I'm just gonna throw in a history video. Okay, okay, okay. Trust me, it'll be good. And then I'll be back, and we can review more profiles. We can watch more videos. We can do more stuff. Why don't you have food? Because I I woke up late and I started stream and I didn't get my food before the stream. Why do you think I just I just said this? Man, you guys are being foolish. Foolish, freaking foolish. Play Minute Legends? Oh, that would be fun. It's the keyword, the keyword is food. <laughs> Osu history. How many of these do you think you'd even get through? I like these side quest videos. These are always fun here. So let's start with one of these. Rucker video, true, truing. I'll never tell you the keyword. I'll never tell you. Okay, should I just make a keyword? Let's, guys. Keywords. Green. That'll inspire you. That'll inspire you to stick around. The keyword is green. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> That's right. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> I'll make everyone stay. Yes. <laughs> Green, blue. Thanks for the follow. Gold. Oh, that's RGB. It didn't. The gift didn't load. It was just white, like pure white for a second. I was like, "What did you? How did? How did you do that?" <laughs> I was amazed. I was I was thoroughly amazed for for all of two seconds. I hope you're enjoying this. I hope you're enjoying this keyword. Be amazed. <laughs> I am. That's pretty crazy. I want to be honest. That's that's actually pretty crazy. Guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be truly and honestly real with you right now. That's that's pretty crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna be truly and honestly real. <laughs> oh man. This person has overlays on Genshin. Wait, really? Sublock activated. We like it, Copy. You're right. Also, you know what? Yeah, I just, I guess I just don't see overlays that often. I don't know. Oh yeah, what, what happened to, what happened to Shimon's play? We were watching Shimon. We're watching Shimon. Oh my God, what is this? Shimon, Dark, Flight, Dreamer. Yes, we were watching this. Remember this? Thank you for the sub look, of course. <laughs> Did you see Karcher of Seed Yomi Yori? What? What? Are you kidding?
<laughs> That's so true. That's so true. Just how do you do this? How do you do this with this accuracy, dude? You know what I'm saying? White cats got unbanned. Did you see? Shimon is the truth. Kinda true. Maybe I do have some food. Maybe I should check. HVIC just got first 500. What? 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 Guys, Saturos hit rank number zero. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. Anytime anyone says that, you guys should just... Or anytime anyone just says, Did you see... Uh, did you see Karcher? Uh, <laughs> Yomiyori FC just say, oh my god, guys. Did you see Saturos just got number zero? <laughs> That's a really good one. Uh, okay, okay. 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 New da 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 Did you guys see this yesterday? He went ham on this. Yeah, next floor. Oh, perfect. Sure. Perfect. Okay, let me check. Let me check the food real quick. Okay, one more try, and I will see. Okay, will we be watching the roundtable, of course, in Discord.gg/Willy. Not Discord.gg/WhiteCat. Although you could join that too if you want to. Holy shit, it would have been insane. <laughs> Fade the section, let's go.
That's pretty good. I'll take it. Let's fucking go. Oh my god, I couldn't have seen so much further. But goddamn. It's still pretty good. That's still pretty fucking good. Streamer is not dead. Streamer is not dead. Streamer has found food. No autoplay? What do you want it to autoplay? You want to play the, the Zootinator monster snap? Wait, what, what was the act on this? Thanks for the follow. Wait, is this in Journey? What did he just pick? Versus Decaton on, a, on CPMC? Or no, no, she played after, okay. What? Is this a farm map? Or is this like the... The tech map. What? The tech oh. map? Is there a tech map of monster? It's just a farm map. A farm map. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't know, dude. Some of these, some of these jumps, they're kind of, kind of stupid. Did you see Azer United? Oh no, I haven't. Um. She gonna FC? Oh my god. Oh, the Osu teenager perception of aging. <laughs> um. <laughs> Can't stick around? That's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Um, 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 um. I got it under control. I know what's up now. <laughs> Dude, I was speed play. I'm a speed player! <laughs> That's pretty funny. This video is pretty good? It is, it is. Dude, the monster? Okay, the monster was fucking funny though. That was pretty funny. I gotta do that right now. I need to get my quick 700 pp. Wait, no one can act this. Go FC Monster, no! Is Discord breaking for anyone else? Let me check. I don't think so. Probably your region. It might be something in your region or your... Your internet's not okay. Keyboard exclamation keyboard. Like I don't know dude, some of these some of these jumps. I'm just not so sure, you know? I feel like they're pretty hard. Willie, you should try full area. I don't know about that. Here. Food time.
ever gotten. This is the first PP ever. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go. I've literally never gotten PP before in my life. Enormous PP. <laughs> I can finally upload! Wow, well, I'm posting this on Twitter. Guys, you gotta hit retweet and you gotta hit like. I think my act could have been better. But that was suspiciously easy, dude. I'm such a DT. Oh, I'm a DT farmer. <laughs> Guys, unfollow. Don't look at me. Did I miss the important part? <laughs> Did I miss un PP? Dude, this act is stupid though, because this is like OD9 anyway. I know. Two ranks? Let's guys! This is the first PP <laughs> I've guys. ever gotten. This is the first PP ever. The first PP? Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go. This looks so doable I'm... nowadays? Yeah, I think people are getting really good now. That's a nice one though. Because that's a classic. That's a classic right there. Let's guys. All right, all right. Keyword is still green. For those, those looking for. do a map review I no I'm not a mapper <laughs> also I'm not playing today if I were playing then maybe I'm no mapper though can we talk about this play what's this play okay yeah we could talk about this oh my ear ah could not turn that down this is the type of map that only cookies you can do seriously you know. This is the cookie Z specialty right here. Like, what was that miss? You could have had that. Dude, that's already two of his three misses, by the way. Not as funny as October 26th, the funniest day of all. Surely this is worth more PP now because the sliders, right? I mean, of course the patterns, right? And of course the rhythm, but I don't get it. You'll never know. Okay, should I should I give you guys the lore? For everybody who was here and missed it? How much would I see on this bin back then? 
Does anyone know? I can't even... 830 for SS right now? Oh, that seems so low. It seems so low, dude. 8.4 stars, though. That's pretty solid. That's pretty solid to me. <laughs> here, we have a... Okay, okay. So for anybody who wasn't here yesterday and is confused, we're bringing back the other funny number. So I was talking about funny numbers. I was like, you know, like... like 727 isn't really as funny. Like, back in the old days, we had 1026, and everyone's like, what are you talking about? So if you were a viewer of the Azer Osu stream... Back in this time, there was the period where Azer kept choking a bunch of plays at 1026 combo. So the curse of 1026 was real. And you would spam 1026 every single time. It was a funny number. And it's actually funnier than 727 because 727 is just, oh, he got the PP. That's it. This is like Azer just kept choking, right? We're laughing at his misery. <laughs> That's what makes this so much funnier. So you'll see, like, there's a time period around here where you just kept getting 1026 combo. So it started out with one map, and then it look three videos in a row of 1026, and then he gets he gets other ones as well. I forget. Uh, do you guys see another one? There's one other one that I'm like missing. Oh, it was uh, it was his do 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 do, or is that this play? Crescent Moon versus 1026. So just confirm here. So we start with the original, okay? Look at this. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do it in hundred retries. Pretty cool map. Pretty awesome map. Right? Barely getting seven star passes. What do you mean? Like, do you see seven star pass here? You gotta remember that the star rating was different back then as well, right? <laughs> so that's that's worth considering. Like, at this point, Keenan already had an eight star FC, but at the time it was like seven stars. So, it was. Okay, here we go. Look. No! Ah! Don't fail. Oh my god, dude! Brum, Look at my ears here. Oh man. My hands can't stay still. Hidden is so free. You say that, but a lot of people prefer new hidden just because uh, the sliders disappearing reduces the, the visual clutter. Like, it basically reduces the density of the map. So people actually. I think I think if you played with this for a while, you'd be like, "That's really weird." A lot of hidden players prefer new hidden overall. The one miss. Holy shit! That PP though. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. So that's the original context. You ready? So then, like the next day or something. Yes. Right. Just... He's playing the map again. He wants this FC. Be a really good play. Again? Again? What the fuck? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> so true. God, the push sound. Oh, this game. Yeah, dude, he had gunners. He had, he had the gamer this glasses. This fucking game. Remember? It's a classic. I miss when everyone cared about gunners. Okay, okay, and then... Two days later, after that one... This one's awesome. Yeah. So he's just playing. He's just gaming, okay? He doesn't even realize this one for like a while. I missed though. Really? So. Really? He does this. He does this. He goes to another map and then chat starts pointing it out. Wait for it. Wait for it. 
Look. No way. No, shut the fuck up. No way. <laughs> See, that's pretty good. <laughs> done. Goodbye. I'm fucking done. God, dude. The willy when you see it. Look at that. So there you go. Okay, and then, and then, of course, later on in the year. This map's awesome. I was trying this map yesterday. I got close. This map's pretty awesome. They don't make maps like these anymore. It's so sad. Plus seven years older, good answer. I had no idea, so... I trust T2's answer. T2's as as answer. Here we go. I mean, sure, I just said they don't make maps like this anymore, because they don't. They don't make, like, you know, CS5, like, not spaced, or I guess kind of spaced sometimes. Like, this nice. one's very unique. That was really fast. Okay. Didn't expect it to get it in, like, pretty much... It was just a star, not in the way... Is it a star? I forgot what it is. Yeah, the, the, the one really space stream, it was just that. Alright, what's my rank now? 400 PP! Oh, I'm still 18. Holy shit, there's a big gap. Okay. Uh, what was that? I think that was better than my previous play, actually. This that song's was... pretty epic, too, by the way. This song's awesome. Uh, no, it wasn't. That was 442 PP. Okay. That's... <laughs> what? No way! <laughs> what the fuck, man? <laughs> Are you serious? Trolled. So now, now you know There's the 1026 lore. 1026. The cursed combo. It comes up everywhere. I don't think he had any other videos on it, but that was, that was a pretty good meme from his stream from seven years ago. I, I, I feel like it... <laughs> If you mentioned it now, if, if you ever saw Azer in, in passing, you were like, Hey, Azer, you remember 1026? You'd be like, oh my god. It would activate like a repressed memory or something. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, yeah, somebody was asking about the 7.7 .7 star. I think I want to look at the map and see like what it still is. You said Promise, right? Do you have a play on Promise? Get... I think he links the map. No, he doesn't. Okay. I'll try auto after this one. Does anyone have this? I know this is loved. It's the Korean penguin. The Korea penguin. 7.9 stars now. It's almost 8 stars. It's this map. Some people have done it. Why is, she, why is she crab? Does anyone know? <laughs> why not? Oh, okay. Makes sense. Dude, there was an Azer video. There's an Azer video once where he got, like, he nearly got a, a hard rack on, on, to my elegy, like, before that was the thing people did. Yeah, he has 600 PP in the dream. I was like, what? Or was it just hidden? I I've seen that part no, hidden hard rack, yeah. <laughs> But like that this part was is this was oh my god this is the really really old version of to my LG. this is like its first qualification or something or second qualification really oh my god hard. nobody remembers this version this is you'll notice it it'll it'll look uncanny to a lot of you it'll look you'll be like 
that looks like to myology, but like kind of not if you're familiar with the map. It's like, it, it'll be really uncanny. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. Is it second Gonka now? I think it is. I think it is. Yeah, look, look at that. Oh, oh. It's like, it looks like to myology, but it, it isn't. You know what I mean? It's not the map that we're used to now. What is this? Like if you've played the map a lot, then you're gonna you're gonna be like, what is going on here? Guys, can I get a green in the chat? Can I get a, a 1026 green in the chat? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> 1026 green. <laughs> It for? Why? Why is this still a question? Why, how is this still a question? That's. Guys, I'm gonna check What's on my food. On? I'm gonna check on my food that I was cooking, okay? Thanks for the follow. Holy fuck, man. This is gonna be so stressful. Every note I don't miss. Adds a BPM to my heart rate. Uh, I choked. What are you guys doing? Streamer isn't gone. <laughs> Streamer isn't gone. Yeah, I didn't even get to the hard part, man. Didn't even get to the hard part, man. God damn. How did I do that? How did he do that? Streamer is here, right here. Okay, that's pretty that's pretty crazy. That is pretty crazy. I will. At least there aren't any PP streams. Fuck yeah. Ah, dude, I'm 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 on an Azer binge right now. I don't know what it is. I like I like watching some of these old old clips because they remind me. Because a lot of these I was here live. Some Rohi song. You have a pretty good score on Henry Right 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 here right here. How good was I it? I just have to. Azer United. Azer United. I I still go back and I watch that score a lot because I don't, it's something. It's very inspiring. You know. At least to me. I don't know if other people feel about it. Joined in 2018, so I know nothing about Azer. So let me let me give you guys a crash course. In, in chat, one if you know about Azer, two if you don't really. <laughs> Let's find out. I want to see how many people. So if you don't know, he, uh, around 2014-2015, he was top 20 uh, uh, hidden hard rock player. Pretty good at a lot of different stuff. Pretty good at tourneys. Stuff like that, so... Uh, most of his, his scores that people know are, are hidden hard rock, but he was really good at DT as well uh, on the side for some scores. But yeah, it was a, he was definitely a rhythm gamer. I can say that because you can see he's playing like BMS. He got big into, into K-Shoot Mania, right? Oh yeah, right here, right? And in other games like that, but he's like, he's like a, a quintessential rhythm gamer. You know what I'm saying? Everyone is saying that I'm hacking in Osu Chat. <laughs> Stop hacking. <laughs> Why do you care? Why do you keep posting this? Why why does it why does how is this relevant to the Azer stream? <laughs> Come on. Ah, this is inspiring. How many people here here of, of the people who didn't know about Azer much? I mean I'm sure you've heard of Azer's United. I mean this was the first hidden hard rock FC if you don't count Adam QS's offline FC. But you know, he grinded this forever and he was able to get it. It was a very a very satisfying score because he choked it like a lot. And the, the one constant was, was just like never giving up and he would play like the never ah. give up video and stuff like that. This chorus is he so just hard, in general. man. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, it's just, I watched this video a lot. It's just very inspiring. Also, this, the skin, listen to the taps, dude. The sounds are so satisfying.
You missed this, 1026? You can't, you can't fool me with a link like that. I'm not stupid. Get to the, the fun part. I was watching this, dude. I was watching this. I wonder. I, I, I always say this. I look back at the Twitch VODs of these on YouTube now. And I, I look at the Twitch chats and I see like people I know. And it's so weird. It's like people I recognize. Okay, I'll be right back. God. Is that the last stream to go? Holy fuck, my heart! and 85 pp holy fucking shit wow oh, man i'm almost fully back hold on just let me get a drink and i'll be fully back okay I think that's... I think that's the highest... Is that the highest PP for a Hard Rock Hidden score, like, ever? Or did Kikizi do something that's better right. than this? I'm back. Oh my god, man. What did I miss? Wait, he FC'd? What? No. How are you guys doing? I'm like, I'm like fucking shaking. Oh man, I can't stay still. 
unsnipable score. True. True. How many plays did that take me? Two hundred and seventy eight plays to do that. Koopa SC two. Thanks for the sub, man. Never give up. Go again. Caleb! Caleb, thanks for the sub, bro. Oh, that's such a good moment, though. It's it's very inspiring seeing that. He doesn't... Did he bring up a never give up? I thought he showed that at the, at the end of the video. I know he does that one of his videos, of one of his plays. Like, right before this, he had a play where, where he did really good. It was just like, never give up. United HR... Maybe it was his HR only on United. Wait, hold on. Wait, let's look at this. BP! Look at this shit! One BP! God damn it! Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> ah. It was a fun time back then. It really was. Oh man. I was excited. Oh yeah, never give up. Here it is, here it is. Can't show no Matt and Row hidden hard rock. Ah. Oh. Yes, dude. This song's kind of a banger though. Kind of like an absolute banger. This song's so good. Okay. I've made my metric ton of, of food right here. It's burning hot, so I need it to cool down, but I've done it. I now have a ton of noodles I can eat. I mean burger. I have a ton of burger I can eat. Old hidden sliders. Yeah, I, I mean like we said that before, right? It's hidden players like it a lot more the new stuff because it it reduces the visual clutter, right? And it effectively brings down the uh, the density. They're not making music? What hell is he? Osu Weekly intro? What do you mean? Oh, the Chucky the Wolf, like, clip series? I never watched it, so I don't know. I think this song's just good. I'm behind. I don't really even, like, watch Osu videos. Apart from just old clips like this. Or new scores. I don't really watch Osu videos. <laughs> I feel like that's a trend. Like, people who do something just don't really watch videos of that kind, I don't think. Well, no, like, I, I don't watch Osu content, but I watch scores still. Like, if, if someone, someone I know uploads a score, I'm like, oh, I want to watch that, you know, I'll check that out. Really light as natural as you breathe. No, the only time I ever watch, like, Osu content is on stream. I don't watch it in my own free time. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, sorry, this is literally the longest roll ever. Just because I had to get food. But I'm good. I'm I'm golden now.
go watch my proof I'm legit or I'm gonna do nothing. Where, do you have proof that you're legit? Prove it. Prove it right now. Dude, I, I love that some things never change. Look at Twitch chat. No one talks while he's playing, but as soon as he's, he's finished with the play, they start chatting. Some things never change. I have so many proof. I have seen the insane map. Oh. Some things never change. Look, look. Wow, Ravucci has 2,700 plays on the big black. <laughs> Why? Some things never change, dude. <laughs> I'm ready for this. Wow, the Kushman Man has 10,700 plays on Identity Part 4. Dude, if you tracked Mikosu, that would actually probably be close. Troll face. Or a senseless massacre. I meme on, on Kush too hard, dude, but it's just really funny because I, I know that he plays other maps, but every single time I tune into his stream without fail- NEVER he's... GIVE UP! Every single time I tune into his stream without fail, he's playing one of these three maps. Senseless Massacre, Identity Part 4, or uh, uh, what's what's the other DT card rock? Um, um, uh, Pure Ruby. Those are the three maps he's ever playing whenever I tune in. I thought you were memeing, but I opened his stream and he was playing Pure Ruby. I'm telling you, it's so funny. He plays them so often that I know for a fact he plays other maps, but it, it looks like, to an outsider, every single time you tune into his stream, it looks like he only plays those three maps and that's it. <laughs> it's really funny. It's really funny. Like, like I could go to... to... The Kush fan, man. Let's go to the Kush fan man. Okay, you ready? Let's go to, to his latest Osuvad because he was playing Shiv the other day. Okay, you ready? Or let's let's just pick a random Osuvad. Okay, this one. Oh wait, this is a highlight. Whoops. Here, hold on. I need I need truly hard seltzer. Now what? made with what? real fruit juice. Okay, perfect. And then we're just gonna skip to a random point and see what he's playing. Okay, let's skip somewhere else. Okay, let's go here. <laughs> let's go here. <laughs> it's three maps. It's literally three maps. It's Senseless Massacre, Pure Ruby. <laughs> I have no clue what else he plays. I don't know either. Oh, 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 there it is. Oh, oh, oh he. <laughs> he literally oh, plays jumps. three maps. <laughs> he has like, like 20 different versions of Senseless so Massacre, though. To the rest of the map. Start playing it on air 10. Look at how many scores he has! I need to stop fucking, like, abuse. Oh my god, it's pure Ruby. Ugh. It's insane. It's insane. He just never stops. He just never stops. Anyway, yeah, wait. He's always grinding and gets a bunch of True. Go to another VOD? Okay. You're right. Maybe, maybe FPP, this is look just... Look at that PP! Yes! 
Oh, it's so. Maybe this was just a strange circumstance. We didn't get him on his on his best vod. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, okay, let's go. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, why does it keep scrolling me up? I'm going down. Stop scrolling up. Okay, okay, let's go to to. I mean that. This, I'm not. Why does it keep scrolling up? Okay, let's go to this one. Wait, this is a- STOP GIVING ME HIGHLIGHTS! Dude, Twitch. Twitch. Please. Please, just fix your- your thing, dude. Okay, perfect. What is this? 14 days ago. Okay, skip ahead. Oh, I don't know what this is. It's not one of the maps. Oh my god, we finally done it. Never mind. Oh my god. It's just, it's like, it's like... He has to have so much play count on like those three maps. There's no way, dude. It's a different pure Ruby map. True, true. So good! Okay, anyway, back to what so I was doing. So fucking good. So fucking good. I have one thing to say. Oh my god, look at the YouTube. Did you see the, the, like, timeline when he hovered over it? pp! <laughs> Did you just say 58.81 pp? <laughs> Wait. Fifty-eight point eighty-one PP. What does that mean? Wait, could someone decipher this? Fifty-eight point eighty-one PP. God, it's so hot. Oh, that's the raw PP again. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Wait, what? Oh, it auto played a video. I was like, I was like, what was that? <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. God, dude, there's just some really good ones. Okay, I'm not gonna stall any longer. We can roll. It's official. I'm allowing you guys to to have a role. You've you've put up with my with my uh, my gaming for too long. I feel bad now. Guys, type the keyword true. Profile views. What? You guys like my my uh, me talking about history videos more than than profile reviews? What is everything so backwards today? Everyone used to want profile reviews. Oh, this one's pretty banging. That rainbow tile and all. I'm not stalling more. I gotta do it. All right. You ready to roll it? Your profile's garbage. That doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. Plus, why hate on your own profile? No, that's not good. You gotta need. You're gonna need some self love here. Come on. I don't play to get better, I get washed. That doesn't mean you don't play to get better. I play to get worse. I play to freaking never improve. I, I <laughs> Every day, I take down the, the maps that I'm playing by one star. <laughs> I'll be playing zero star maps in no time. negative star maps it's just too easy all right you guys ready to roll it you prepared i am volk zw 
Did I even remotely get close to a pronunciation on this? They have a minute to respond. Hey, there you are. Link your profile. Not Vinny reroll. <laughs> No, it's fine. Okay, my pronunciation was okay. That's good. Volkesh. That's how I would say it. I'm an English speaker, so that's how I would say it. Anyway, joined October 2017, which is coming up on five years. Half a decade of playing this game, but maybe not so, because you don't even have three years worth of playtime. You have closer to two and a half. So, hopefully you've been enjoying the game. Hopefully you've been gaming. A tub of burger. This is my food. This is literally all the food I have. I... It's sad, but it's all the food I have. I have noodles. Mmm. <laughs> it's better than nothing. The burger tub. You guys not like noodles? Not like rotini? Where are my Italians? Wait, where did the Italians go in chat? This is rotini. Mmm. Wow. How starchy. <laughs> it's true, it's true. Rank score, you got a, a pretty solid amount of rank score, eight billion. And, you know, it's not it's not it's not a ton of rank score, but um it's something maybe maybe also an indicator that you're playing shorter maps, that you're playing a lot of the same maps over and over again. I don't know. I'm not so sure. Hit accuracy is really good though. Ninety eight five one. I guess a thumbs up. He didn't even cook it, he soaked it in cold water for an hour. Mmm, <laughs> tasty. <laughs> um, I already forgot what I was doing. I'm gonna be honest, I already, f you just, you just like stun locked me. Rotini, basically Fusili. What is Fusili? I know Fusili, the streamer. Pasta variety. I mean, I guess. Oh, commonly known as rotini in the United States. Oh. Oh. This doesn't look like rotini at all. What? What is this? This looks like macaroni. What is this? This is not rotini. This is not... This is not rotini. Hold on. Rotini actor. This is literally not rotini. Maybe solid or hollow? Oh, oh, maybe because these are hollow. These are hollow. Okay, so it's solid. Solid fusili is rotini. Do you guys know solid fus fusili? Can we look this up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait. Hold on, images. Dude, why don't I just look up rotini so you know what it is? Okay. Oh my god, this might literally be the box that I got. Oh my god. Yeah, it's just this. You cook it, and it's like that. It's like, ooh, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. They're selling you less pasta per fusilli? <laughs> True. Non-Americans are getting so scammed. Okay, okay. Anyway, sorry, back to your profile review. Uh, play count 64k with 10.7 million total hits does bring you to 165 hits per play, which is on the lower side of average. So we have two recommendations. Number one, try not to retry spam. It's something everyone does. It's hard to, to not do, right? It's a bad habit that you form, but limiting yourself to only, you know, five or even just like three plays per session for a single map, right? You'd be like, I'm going to play this map five times. You count down your times. Once you're out, just be like, I'm gonna I'm gonna play that map a week from now, right? Just give yourself some time to cool off on the map, go play something else. Because you're you're able to play something else, you can you can help yourself, you know, 
uh, uh, gain skill, right? Hopefully enough skill to be able to do the map the next time that you play it. And you know, you're doing this with all the maps that you're playing. It's not like you're just doing one map and then you're going to the next one and retry spamming when you didn't retry, right? So five tries for all the maps and, and hopefully this will push you to, to play a, a wider variety of different maps and also not overplay the same stuff because you could mind block yourself. You could, you know, form bad muscle memory on patterns and break your consistency and you don't want that to happen. So it's it has quite a few benefits from doing that. You used to play short map? Makes sense, makes sense. The other thing is of course playing maps all the way through start to finish, which, you know, you might be tempted to go for FCs, right? I know, I, I personally love getting FCs on maps, right? All the time, but it's, it's much better for you to instead of, you know, in the middle of the map, oh, I missed, L let me quit out or, or let me retry. Just playing all the way through, continuing playing, even if you miss, even if you slide a break, even even if anything happens, right? Just keep playing the map all the way through because it will help build up your consistency and you'll get to practice all the patterns in the map evenly, right? Uh, imagine this, you're retrying, you don't really get to the ending, right? You're practicing the beginning of the map a ton, but the ending, eh, maybe not so much, right? So. Uh, uh, actually just playing all the way through, right? All the way through, all the way through. Even if you fail, you know, there, there, just be like, oh, well, whatever, I, I, I tried, right? Uh, uh, just try your best to, to play all the way through and not retry spam, and then you'll see probably a, a noticeable gain in consistency and you'll, you'll be, you know, more efficiently playing maps than you would be before. It's true. Max combo 1940, I have no idea. It's too low for me to be able to guess. Usually we try and guess combos if they're high enough because there's only a few maps that have like 5,000 combo, right? So it's pretty easy to guess them. But for this case, uh, there's probably 10,000 maps that have this combo. So I'm not gonna be able to. So if you want to tell us, feel free. I'll just be waiting here, eating my fusilli, my solid fusilli. It's the Toho Marathon. Really? You played Zune nonstop medley? That's, that's spite. We're thinking of the same one, right? So it's a choke on this? This? Really? <laughs> that's pretty spicy. I can respect that. Or is it a different map that I don't know about? Not this one? Oh, what Toho Marathon? I there's no other Toho marathons that I'm aware of. Toho X Bosch Rus Boss Rush? Oh wait, that's, whoops. Oh, Senya Songs, okay, that makes sense. Okay, that makes sense, that's still, that's still respectable. I can respect that. Good one, good one. Well, you're really close to 2000 combo, I think you should shoot for that. And also, that this is to say, play longer maps, get used to it the more that you're playing, right? Because you know, if it, it, it's hard to focus on a five minute map when you first start, right? You're not, no one's born sitting here like for five minutes straight able to do that, right? So start playing some longer and longer maps, right? If you're playing, you know, two to three minute maps, start playing some three to four minute maps, just get used to it and then maybe even some four to five. I'm not saying go out there and play like an 18 minute map or something. I'm just saying, you know, start to, to add to your, your playing diet some more, you know, different maps. It's true, it's true. Or I guess longer maps. So generally I like to see these ranks add up to be about equal to or higher than your A's. It just shows a little bit of consistency and stuff, right? Because you're not generally going back and replacing your SS's with A's, or at least I hope that you're not doing that, or <laughs> that would be a shame if that happened. But you know, uh, uh, it is a bit lower, so I'm not sure if consistency is an issue. Consistency we usually define as your ability to perform on demand. You'll usually see people bring it up in the context of uh, FCing maps, right? Like. If you're playing seven and a half star maps, you would kind of expect that you would be able to, to just FC a, like a random 5.0 star map, right? You know, that should be easy for you, right? Uh, but for some people, maybe not the case if they haven't practiced trying to FC these sorts of things before, right? We'll plug in OC plus, exclamation OC plus. You check out my play on Dandelion. It's on the leaderboard, sure. If you link it. <laughs> That was very confusing, but yeah. So um, think about like like how comfortable you are, like where your comfort zone is for for FCing stuff, right? 
and make sure that that you're capable of doing things, right? Because just like we said, right? You don't want to be you want to be a player that's playing, you know, seven stars map, getting getting a couple of misses on them and not not able to do five stars at all, right? So that's that's where consistency comes in. And uh, A's, it's not to say that having a ton of A's is bad. You know, I just said consistency, get get S ranks, get FCs, get stuff like that. But A's are actually really good, right? Because if a good portion of these A's are you challenging yourself, going outside your 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 you know, comfort zone, uh, playing maps that you find hard, playing maps that are just, just, you know, challenging you in aim, challenging you in tapping, challenging you in reading, that is what you need to do. That is first and foremost improvement. And it does come, you know, at ends with, with the consistency, right? You, you play, you know, consistency to, to try and be able to FC maps. You play these to, to not really FC, but to, to try and play maps that, that you find really, really hard, right? It's kind of a balance, right? You play too many consistency maps, you're not going to be improving a ton, right? You're not going to be playing harder stuff. If you only play the hard stuff, you're not going to be able to FC, you know, the, the stuff that you should find easy. So kind of think about it. Kind of think think about the balance. Bro, just send me, send me your, your score. I want to see. You wanted to show me your epic leaderboard score. I'll look at it. I'll look at it on stream for, for all of 10 seconds. I will. I promise you. So that's good. First and foremost, right? Push yourself, push your limits. Always be playing stuff that you find hard or that you find awkward or that you might not even like in the game. I will, yeah, I promise you. I will leave it on screen for 10 seconds. Here. Willio 2 Hyper. Okay, you ready? You ready? My 10 seconds of fame, okay, okay. Where are you on the leaderboard? You're leaderboarded? Oh, you're right, you're number two on this. Okay, okay, this is huge. This is huge. Okay, you ready? You ready? Oh, wait, I, I didn't set the timer. I didn't set the timer. I just, I tried to set a timer for 10 seconds. Oh my god. <laughs> I was actually gonna do it. It was gonna be the speed run. It was gonna be so good. Oh, okay, you get more than 10 seconds then. Look at that. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. This guy's kind of crazy, yeah. Has it been more than 10 seconds? What do you guys think? <laughs> Two minutes. All right. Good score though. Good stuff. <laughs> All right. Back to the profile group. Z z z z z z z z z. Peak at 28k. Hey, you'll be there soon enough. You'll be back. You'll be gaming, right? It looks like you just went inactive for a couple months, something like that. So hey, you know, you just keep playing the game. You're gonna get better. That's how it is. Ooh, going for some C's. I don't know. I, I will tell you this. A's and B's. Are you pushing yourself? Once you're getting to C territory, it's it's kind of debatable whether you're really like learning from the maps, right? Because you want to play these maps that are hard enough for you to to Big you know follow. push your own limits th for you to to be able to, to game, right? It's fine if you're playing these for fun, but if you're if you're expecting improvement from C's or D's, then that's not really going to be the case. It looks like that was just for you know for fun. That might have just been a couple maps, so just just keep that in mind. I just want to throw that out there, you know. Some people, some, you know, it, it's, this is an extreme example, but imagine like the people who just joined the game and then they go play Galaxy Collapse because they're like, I want to be like my favorite top player. They get a D rank on it, you know, and they're like, oh my God, that was so good. I, I, I'm playing really hard maps. That must mean I'm improving when they can't even understand the map at all. It was for fun. Yeah, exactly. You know, so that's why I say that. Anyway. Yo, my cow, Koi Wazurai. Wa 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 I can never say this name right. I can li I have never said this name correctly. I used to call it Byomai Kawarazai, but I know that's not right. It's <laughs> I like I like flipped like four of the letters in here to get that in my mind, and I still cannot say it right to this day. Hey, nice ten point three score right here. Not the best accuracy, but hey, it's maybe maybe something that you know you're getting used to ten point three. You're starting to get it, and then you can improve over time. It's pretty solid. It's pretty solid. B yo may B yo may Koi Wazu Rei. You mean Byo Mai Kawarazai? 
<laughs> I'm gonna keep saying it like that just to make people mad. You know what? Now that I know how to say it correctly, I'm just gonna say it like that. I'll never stop. There's some other ones that people argue with me on about the pronunciation. People argue with me on like... What's the map? There was some map that I, I I said the name of. Everyone's like, "Are you stupid? Are you insane?" And I uh, they said it like they said like one vowel of the the name like slightly different, and they act like I'm insane. Thanks for the follow. What Neuronesia? That's not a word though. That doesn't matter. Halcyon. I say Halcyon. Some people say Halicon, Halicion or something. <laughs> it's not how you say it, it's Halcyon. Pseudopeton. I don't think I said that wrong. I think I said that correct. I, there was something, if you guys can think of it, there, there was something where people were like yelling at me for saying it wrong, but I was saying it exactly right, and we brought up the pronunciation, and then I played it, I was right, and then everyone's like, no, you're wrong. The pronunciation's wrong. <laughs> you, guys are, you guys are just trying to troll me. I'm the enemy, I'm public enemy number one just because I'm the streamer, right? Anyway, take a look at your top plays. Get some pretty solid one. Bro, this guy just said exit this Earth's atomosphere. Don't you know it's atomosphere? <laughs> oh, Oshinus. I said Oshinus, and then Yanaro was like, Did you just. What did you just say? Oh my god, I'm totally right about this too, by the way. Translate.google.com. Oceanus. Oceanus. <laughs> Oceanus. Oceanus. No one's saying it Oceanus. No one's saying this. That's the thing, though. Ocinus. Ocinus. <laughs> Ocinus. <laughs> Let's do German. Oceanus. Oh my god, what is wrong with you? <laughs> Do French? <laughs> Wait, let's do Finnish. Malta Mary. Okay, well that's just not right. <laughs> Oceanus. Oceanus. A Korean? Okay, okay, let's do Korean. Wait, where? Where? Oceanus. Oceanus. Okay. I'll type this into Google Translate in Korean and we'll see what happens. Okeanos. What? Okeanos. Okay, this is wrong. This is wrong. Uh no, that's wrong. Um anyway. <laughs> guys, guys, did you know that <laughs> Did you know <laughs> that the song's name isn't D for the Delta? This is another one. D for the... You guys know D for the Delta by Camilla? Yeah. It's not D for the Delta. If you look at the original song, it's Delta for the Delta. How could they get this wrong? It's true. It's true. But technically the romanization, because Delta is D in the Greek alphabet, it's D for the Delta. Let's look this up. It's Delta for the Delta! <laughs> oh my god. There's never a D for the Delta. It's true. Okay, 
Okay, sorry. Sorry for the distraction from your profile. I know. Look, we get on some tangents sometimes. It's just what happens, okay? So it's just Elta? No, no, no. It's D for the Delta. Delta for the Delta. Araby. <laughs> Araby plus E. Plus Araby plus E. I like that one though. Have you had any Pokemon pronunciations in the chat before? Araby first HR passed. <laughs> Dude. If, what did he think? What did he think that the the diff name was then? O plus world, D one rec plus ten n. <laughs> like, what do you think? <laughs> like, what 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 what, it, what would that even mean? What would that even like like begin to mean? Araby plus e. <laughs> Araby plus E, connect plus 10N. Or, or connect plus 10N. Oh my god. I'm kind of spitting facts, though. <laughs> anyway, so your top plays. Uh, different mods going on. I mean, you do have a hard rock here, and it is a little bit of a longer map right there. Okay. Floating up by Kotoko. Is there like a new floating up farm map? There is. Oh. Yeah, wait, no, I remember this. I did a video on this one. Floating up. I thought this was like a... Oh, God. I, I confused this with a... With a... She floats? You guys remember she floats? Oh, my God. H how do I find this? What's that song name? Someone floats. I don't know who floats. Is it he floats? They float? I float? Who floats? Who is floating? Yeah, there it is. Who floats? I, I confuse it with this for some reason. <laughs> Guys, who floats? What is this? Don't worry about it. Anyway. 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 Definitely uh, uh, some good stuff you're throwing on hidden on, on a lot of these uh, more generic type maps that where it's just jumps. So think about throwing hidden on some more normal ones like Beyond My Covers. I mean, of course, this one's probably really hard since you just got the score three days ago and it's your number five. But if you were to play it on like, like I don't know, Marissa Quest, you Thanks got this a month ago, maybe that would be a cool hidden, right? You can throw that on. It's it's much more more even practice. I feel like like maps that are just jumps, that simple rhythm with, with nothing else are pretty easy to, to, to mod in overmod, right? To throw on hidden, hard rock, or double time on. They're they're fairly simple. Right? So throwing on, on hidden on on more well rounded maps, more generic type maps that, that aren't just jumps is a good thing to, to practice. Okay? Like this. Like this is pretty cool. This is a really cool score in fact. I love this map. This map is really good. I'm glad that you played this. I love this map. Sorry, I'm jamming out. I had a video on this on YouTube back when I first started playing, or when I got my first, like, Hindi TFC. I, I think I got rid of it because I was like, oh, that's a bad score. Such a good score. Why did I even, like, get rid of that video? Man, I'm so sad. I got rid of a ton of my old videos that I was like, oh, that's a bad score. I might as well get rid of that. <sighs> it's so good, too. I played it because of you, really? Told you it's a good song. It's a good song. You should also play. Here's my challenge to you. You ready? I want to see you get a score on the true and honest. Uh, sorry, wa Chisana. Here it is by Frostmorn, also known as Frost XC. I want you to DT this. I want you to get this score. <laughs> 
Please. Everyone plays the farm map. You got a score in this too? Oh my god. Oh my god. Val... Val... Kiyash. I forget the A. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, okay. Solid accuracy. Okay, okay. See, you're ahead of the curve, dude. I, I hate that people just only play the farm map of that. It sucks. I guess I, if I had scrolled down more, I would have seen it anyway, but... Yeah. Uh, definitely some hard work, so that's interesting. Uh, mainly on jump maps, though. Uh, uh, um, meaning does have, like, a stream. Lots of bursts, stuff like that. Or I guess a few bursts, right? But, you know, start throwing some hard work on uh, some more interesting stuff. And you, you'll game. You really will. Uh, lots of DT. So uh, one worry might be that you're you're playing maps that, that you might be reacting to more than just reading, right? So reading is, is one of the most important skills in the game. It's also one of the most neglected skills in the game for a lot of people because they don't think about it or they don't really play it at all. But it's definitely worth your time. Right, to figure out is so maybe i don't know if you want to practice playing some more nomad it it's all about the density of notes and getting your brain to to figure out how to to break down patterns and understand what patterns you're seeing on the screen does that make sense hmm how does he pick random chance purely random chance that's how i pick jinkala is the real format Oh yeah, Jinkala. Then Jinkala. It's in my head now. I can't stop. I can't stop thinking about that. But yeah, that it's something to think about. Think about your weaknesses as well, right? Because I mean, you are playing a lot of more more normal maps. Oh my god. Oh my god. You're just playing my favorite maps. This is also one of my favorites. This is one of my favorite maps. I did this one at LAN. Oh, it's a good score. I love this. This is a really good song too, dude. Uh. You're 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 saving me by looking at your top plays. I keep oh. oh god, it's so good. Can't play Nomad? Hey, then you must play Nomad. That's that's the secret. If you're not used to it, you gotta play it. Look, you might not be able to FC now, but the longer and longer that you keep playing it for, you're gonna get it, right? Especially some of the stuff that you played eight months ago, you would expect, I mean, I, I know that you took a break at some point, right? Because we saw your, your graph of inactivity. But, you know, if you're improving since then, if you've improved since the point where you were eight months ago, then, then maybe you could go for FCs on some of these maps that you were trying back then, rather than, you know, some of the really, really hard maps all the way up here. You gotta think about it, right? It's, it's like... Sometimes you gotta make the maps easier to practice certain skill sets, right? You know? Sometimes, I mean, you, your, your DT skill, right, might be up here. You might be playing whatever, you know, star rating this is. Let's see, right? Six stars, right? And this is this is definitely six stars as well, right? Somewhere around there, at least. Yeah, 6.2 stars, right? But, you know, if you're not used to no mod at six stars, then it's gonna be really hard. It's gonna be you know, nearly impossible for you to do. So if you want to start playing Nomad, maybe even just play some, you know, five-star Nomad maps and see how you're doing on those. And if you can FC those pretty confidently, you're like, okay, this is boring. I can do this definitely. Move up, right? Stair-step your way up into stuff. And of course, work on density, work on stuff like that because that's the big part of reading, right? Is, you know, you, you think about like like low AR when you when you usually mention reading, you, you'll think of like easy players and stuff. We're like, oh yeah, they're reading AR4 maps and stuff like that. You don't, you don't have to do that for reading. For reading... You just need density. So if you need to, bring up the BPM, right? Even something like AR9 at 200 BPM, right? If you have any maps that are AR9.0 flat at like 200, 210, 220 BPM, those are really hard. Those are really highly dense maps, or at least comparatively to a lot of the stuff that you're playing, you know, right here, which, you know, is going to be like, like, what's, what's, oh, oh, here's the other story about Chisana. I mean, this is 218 right 218 yeah 218 at like ar 9 point or no ar 10 exactly oh my god yeah that's right it is area 8.5 i was gonna i thought this was just eight but yeah you know so think about bringing that bringing maybe the ar down a little bit and the bpm up a little bit just to just to practice reading for for nomad and density once you're once you're more used to nomad nomad i like to think of it at least uh after the the talk about it was spare as like the foundation 
of your skill, right? If you are good at Nomad, if you have a really strong Nomad base, you can branch out and do everything else from there. Whereas if you don't really know to do stuff in Nomad, then how do you expect to, to be able to branch out, right? It's like you're you're stuck on this branch and you gotta you gotta get into Nomad to get into everything else. What if I only play Nomad? Then you're not playing enough. If you only play Nomad, you're not challenging yourself. Probably. Most likely. I mean you can get better, right? You can get really better. But you're gonna you're gonna bottleneck yourself because you're gonna run out of like you're not gonna find a lot of high CS maps, right? Stuff like that with hard rock to to, to learn precision and aim in that way, right? You're not gonna find a ton of high OD maps with hard rock right like you could with with od10 you're not gonna teach yourself to read in a different way with hidden right uh, you're not gonna find a ton of nomad maps above you know 230 240 250 bpm unless they're like eight stars right so then how do you expect to improve at speed without dt as well i mean dt is basically nomad if you think about it and if you also think about it hard rock is basically nomad if you think about it hidden is basically nomad <laughs> But yeah, I'm sorry. I, I might have just gone on a huge tangent on your profile. You have some really, really cool stuff, right? Of course, like I say, some of these jokes you can always go back and fix them. It's not like they're they're set in stone. You did this two years ago. If you've if you have the ability to do this now, why not do it? You know, why not? Go for it. See what you can do. Man, this reminds me of uh, a, a lot of these from from the the ancient days. I, I just saw like growing. I remember this map. <laughs> You know? Oh man. Reminds me. Reminds me of the old days, you know? <laughs> good stuff, good stuff. You got this. Think of your weaknesses, okay? That's probably the biggest thing I can say. You know what you're weak at. I'm not gonna get a, a whole like picture of who you are as a player just from looking at a hundred plays on your profile. But you know personally like what you struggle with, the things that you hate and stuff like that. And I say things that you hate for a reason, I'll tell you about that. So practice those, or at least practice those more than you are already, right? Because you wanna be the strongest player that you can be, okay? And I say things that you hate, right? I mentioned, oh, things that you might find awkward, things that you find challenging, things that you hate. Why would you want to play things that you hate? I thought you were trying to enjoy the game. And the answer is because if you don't practice, you know, if, if you hate them, you're not going to practice them. It's true, right? I hate hidden. I've hated hidden for a long time. You know what happened for me for the longest time? I hated hidden, so I would play, you know, hidden ones and be like, oh, am I good at hidden right now? I, so I would play hidden. Oh, can't do it. Oh, well. Then I wouldn't practice it. And I wouldn't get any better at it. And then I would come back months later and be like, oh, am I better at hidden now? I'm not going to get better at it unless I practice it. I want myself to be strong. I want myself to be a stronger player. As much as I hate playing with Hidden, I still do it. I was playing with Hidden yesterday. I was literally playing with Hidden yesterday. It's true. I was playing with Hard Rock yesterday too. I hate Hard Rock. A lot of my top plays now are Hard Rock because they, they give me a challenge. I still hate Hard Rock. Hard Rock sucks, dude. Trying to get... <sighs> Some maps make me so mad with their offsets, dude. And Hard Rock only worsens that so much. Sure, man. Keep telling yourself. What do you? What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> I mean, some of these are without hidden, but you know. There was a. Uh... Oh God, what was it called? That was a guys. I tried yesterday. Moikai, lower diff. I cannot hit it. I literally cannot hit that. Moikai. This, right? No, Armin's Extreme. I cannot do this. It's so easy. I absolutely cannot do this map. <laughs> Look at my accuracy. This is not an FC. <laughs> I cannot do this. I don't know how you're supposed to aim this. <laughs> Actually impossible. Zuto Zuto Saga Shite Among Us. Did I say it right? They do good. Anyway, sorry, sorry, back to your profile. I, I keep getting distracted. You, you can't let me get distracted, man. How else am I supposed to do it? Real, real lyrics. It is, it is. Alright, so medals, you don't have to go for medals. They're like achievements in other games, right? You do a little, a little funny challenge, you get a little icon on your profile to commemorate it. It's like, you know. 
So you, you rack up achievements the more that you play and they can be fun to go for. A lot of these are challenges that you kind of have to go out of your way to get or they can be pretty fun to get. A lot of the earlier hush hush achievements, a lot of the later ones are really, really hard. So don't feel bad if you can't get them. Like I I can't even get like like 10 of them or something. And I'm, I'm at this level. Look, look at all these ones that I can't get because they're too hard. Man, this sucks. This game sucks. But hey, there's lots of ones that I find fun as well, right? So maybe metal farming is something for you. And this is to say, right? I think you should give yourself a side quest to know so. I think everybody should have that, right? Because if you're mainly focused on ranking, if you're mainly focused on just improving or tournaments or whatever, you're going to burn out at some point, right? And you want something to fall back on, something to, to just keep you keep you going, right? When you don't want to really like play the game. Otherwise, you know, you might end up quitting and that would be a shame. You dump in so much effort just to just to quit like a lot of top players do right some people farm rank score they try and get as much rank score as they can and there's an entire ranking for it i don't know if you know this apparently some people don't on the website so you could you could try and get your rank score rank high or you could farm ss ranks or you could farm top 50s on maps or even number ones if you get to be that good right you can decide what you want to like my moderator mr keys he's decided oh i want to fc every single map by the artist kano so he plays every single Kano song and he's he has like a, a his user page shows like his completion of Kano. You can see it actually here. Let's bring it up. Keys. Let's see this. Let's take a look. Kano FCs to date. Oh man. Okay, here we go. Let's see the sheet. Okay, so he's he's working on it. See, if you give yourself just like some funny little side quest like this, it'll keep you more engaged in the in the game. It'll give you something fun to just go for whenever you're like, I don't really want to play today. I won't. I don't want to grind skill or like go for serious scores. I just want to like chill out. You could usually go for something like this, you know. It's only the top diffs. I don't think so. I think no, no, because look, FC is diffs. <laughs> right here. So he's, he's missing one FC on, on, on this and this. <laughs> he's so close. So close. How much completion though is there here? There's total, oh, he doesn't, he doesn't do percentage. So sad, but that's really close to, to finish. He's, he's doing it, he's gaming. So yeah, give yourself something to do in the game. Metals might be that. There's a huge metal farming community. Anytime that they release new metals, there's there's metal hunters who try and like solve the metals. And that could be you in the future if you find that fun. Who knows? Peaking at 3.6 thousand plays in a single month. 93%? Ooh, yes. There sure are. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Vince. Don't talk. Don't talk about this around Vince. We seem to have struck a nerve. <laughs> oh man. Uh, all right, but yeah, lots of plays. So hopefully, you're not retry spamming as much, right? At least I hope, personally. You have a good amount of maps played. You have a you have a pretty solid amount. So you, maybe you are downloading lots of different types of maps and and doing that, right? And that is to say, you know, go outside your comfort zone. If you're not used to tech maps, download some tech maps, right? Some easier tech maps just to get into them, right? Just to, to start to feel out the patterns, right? Because like I said, you want to be the strongest you can be. Maybe it's alt maps. Maybe it's linear aim, you know, precision maps from the old days. Maybe it's, you know, awkward jumpy aim style from like the, the second diff of top of the M. That's pretty popular nowadays. I really like awkward jumps. Those are really fun. But, you know, whatever it is. Keep downloading it. I mean, the play counts are high, but hey, you know, you are playing lots of different maps, to be fair. So that's good. I want the metal from the makeup map, really? Yeah, you can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. You got it. I can't FC this three stars map. See, and that, that should be a signal to you, right? Remember what we said about consistency? Now, of course, some maps, right? Some maps are going to be just annoying because of like the AR right and and the density right so maybe uh, uh it's that the the three-star map because it's very old it was ranked in like 2008 it might be like really high density and you're just not used to that but you know it, normally when you think of a three-star map you would think about being able to fc that so reading definitely a part of that right really focus on just like aiming it right aiming it right and like hitting on beat right don't don't hit too early don't hit too late it's i i don't know that's that's pretty much my advice for that. Keep downloading the maps, experience new patterns, because that's how you improve, right? You learn to hit new patterns, you learn to do things like that. We've reached into your profile. Do you have any questions or anything else you want us to look at? 
so we'll look at them. It is AR5, so that is quite annoying. I mean, have you tried it with hard rock? Man, I'm just saying, look, look. I I don't want to make this impossible on you. It shouldn't be that hard, but... Have you tried it with hard rock? <laughs> you can do the first diff? Oh yeah, that's right. You could do... You could just do the normal. Oh. That would be pretty easy. Oh my god! Look at that! Look at that! Oh, I'm, I'm literally so gaming. Old. I'm an old man. That's awesome. Pin that? Nope. Don't think I will. That's pretty awesome, though. My pin scores are, are fun how they are. I like my pin scores. Oh, all my pin scores are gone. Anyway, anything else? Anything else? Or have we reviewed your profile? Do you guys think I've done it? I think that was a solid profile review, you know? I mean, if you have any questions, you know, you can you can, you can can give them to me. I'm always here. I'm always sitting here at my stream constantly, every day. Pretty much every single day, guys, I stream. You know this, right? Anyway, let's watch more Azer videos. Or let's watch some old Willy videos. You guys want to watch old Willy videos and talk about, like... I don't have a ton of, like, super old ones, unfortunately. But the ones that are up, we should watch. This map taught me how to stream in Osu. Look at this EOS FC. Look at how I used to be, dude. Is this awesome or what? So what? What's wrong with the tablet? What? This song's good. This map's good. I'm not shaking, guys. This is just me aiming. This is like the origin story of the shake. My saddest V1 moment? Sure. Oh wait, I actually got a really good play yesterday. I forgot to mention. Alright, we didn't get the watch. Scorpy one moment. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, but just FC it. <laughs> Have you considered just FCing it? I hate to say it. I hate to be that guy. But this isn't as bad as as FCing and getting Scorpy one. Still combo sucks, dude. <laughs> combo sucks. Combo sucks. We should just should just make combo better. Make combo better. That's my official review. I have nothing asking more thing for review. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. Okay, look at this. This was like two years after I started playing the game. Oh, 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 this is a banger. Oh, wait, he's aiming. Oh my god. Guys, are you seeing this? Are you, are you seeing this? You 
do more pro color views? Maybe. I want to watch some videos. Let's use 6.3.9 W. Oh, God, I remember when you used to have to like choose what the best Wacom driver was. That's insane, dude. I, I have no idea. I just used whatever came with my tablet. The same stresses me out. Why? Yeah, think about this. You know what? You know what, chat? Think about this. Next time you complain about my current day aim. It could be worse. <laughs> Don't most people use Open Tablet Driver? But this was before Open Tablet Driver existed. Like, five years before it started existing. <laughs> It's true. It's hard to imagine a world without open tablet driver because it's so useful, dude. Uh, I don't know what I would do without open tablet driver, honestly. <laughs> Spin. Dude, I reacted so slow to spinners back then. This is before I, I played like a million ninja spinner maps. And I, I, I fear for my life now. That's something that old maps will teach you. Old maps will teach you to fear for your life in the middle of a play. Because if you if you blink for one second, you will miss a spinner. And then you'll you'll, you know, miss. And then fail. Because HP is HP, you know, like ten on all old maps. This is awesome. Look at this screenshot. Okay. That's pretty that's pretty epic. 200 ppm. 78 you are. Look at that. Willie got the Thomas Jefferson grip in this play. He bow to sign the declaration. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. My first 200 PP play. Are you ready for this? I think this is a this is a pretty spicy. I think if you look at this now, people would be like, "What? This is this was only 200 PP back." No, this map is so good. Yeah, this was so easy too. This is such a farm map. Literally the easiest map ever. I could have seen this in my sleep. You got booked the six stars? I know. And, and canonically, the first Willy six star FC came in like like, I forget what it is. I think it was I was mind blocked super hard. I think it came in like the middle of twenty sixteen or something canonically. So I actually got my first six star FC like significantly earlier, <laughs> and also on a map that I thought was easy. That's the funniest part. Oh. I would like some chocolate balls. They sound tasty. If you think about it, they sound tasty. That's a good one. That's a banger. Ooh, I remember I uploaded this. Such a gap between my 200 and 300. I uploaded this because this was crazy high OD at the time for me. Isn't this OD9? This is the top diff. Also 200? Nope. My FC on this was 199 PP currently. Back then it was like 180 PP or something. So it was not 200 enough. Oh man, look how much I was like struggling with OD9 back then. 
That's why this play was so important to me. Look at how awesome this is. No, no, I'm not playing Crawl again. I don't- look, if I pass the spinners on Crawl, I'm fine. That's the way I see it. What's your opinion on Cursor Trail? Oh wait, 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 wait! I thought it was so cool for hitting that. Hitting those streams at, at OD9, I was like, oh my god, I'm so cool. I, what do you mean, opinion on Cursor Trail? I, I think it depends on the trail, right? I mean, it, you could show me a Cursor Trail, I'd be like, okay, that's good, right? It depends on the skin, because it works. There, it's not like, oh, I hate Cursor Trails or anything like that. It doesn't matter. It depends on the skin. I can play with trails or without trails. It doesn't it doesn't impact me at all. I mean, my skin is like halfway between having a trail and not. Guys, does okay. In your opinion, does Kamui have a true and honest cursor trail? I want to know what people think. Not really. Yes. Interesting. You can barely see it. No, but that's the important thing. This is what helps me when I. This is literally why I use the Kamui cursor. Is because when you want to not see the cursor trail, you just see the cursor. But when you want to see a trail, like when you're flow aiming, you can still see the trail. Like you can you can selectively view whether you see the trail or not. Do you get what I mean? That's why it works so well for me. What does that mean? What do you mean, what does that mean? I think it's obvious what I mean. There is a trail. There is a Kamui cursor trail. But the trail is, like, very transparent. And, like, you... you when you're playing, you wouldn't really notice it. Unless you were looking for it. You know what I mean? It's, it's like, a very faint, like, like pink trail. It's like a it's like a circle and it's like like 20% opacity or something. Like it's not at all what you would normally think of as a trailer. Dude, look at this. This is- this might be the best comment I've ever received. Ever. What do you think of that? God, dude. Sick play, bro. So this is a music game? Pretty cool. Yeah, called Osu. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh. It feels so foreign, it's true. I mean, it was a different time. It was a different place, you know? Man, that's a good play right there. Okay, next play I uploaded was my first 300 PP play, guys. What, what's everyone here's first 300 or if you have if you have a 300 I, I'm sorry I just presumed <laughs> thanks for the follow or what 300 are you close to getting if you don't have one yet how weird this was my first ever 300 easiest farm map ever 
People look at me, I've shown this to people, they've been like, what? How did you get such a cool first 300? There's no way. This was like the most boring farm map ever back in the day. This was never cool first 300. Apparently it is now, but canonically or at the time? At the time. This is, this is not, I mean, this is like 380 canonically, or, yeah, but at the time, this is 339, because this is my second play on the map in that day. I wouldn't say it's cool still. Well, it wasn't cool back then. Maybe it's cool now, but it wasn't cool back then. <laughs> it was a very, very mundane play back then. I think you have to have pretty high act to 300 this no mod now. You are completely wrong. You're completely wrong. My my no mod play on this map is almost 400 PP because I improved the act. So how much is what, what act did I get on this? I don't even remember what my act was. 9931 250s 19 100s. 19 100s. 250s 19 100s. That's 361 PP. <laughs> My current- I have a Nomad play, because I fixed that later on. I have a Nomad play that's- that's 3 100s, and that's 387 PP. <laughs> it's so free. That was before I, uh, I hard rocked it, of course. Because this map is so easy and it's so farm. Of course, naturally, that's what you do, right? Anyway. I thought I was so cool back then. This skin still looks pretty clean, apart from the 100s. What do you guys think? Maybe I should bring this skin back. This look, this is pretty clean. The slider ends. You guys gotta stop crying about slider ends. Go play with slider ends. Force yourself to play with slider ends. It's not hard to do. I'm, I'm really turning into an old man. I'm sorry. I'm being very combative just because people are mentioning slider ends. I swear I'm not usually this rude. Look like trash. Skins look so much better with slider ends, honestly. Well, some skins. player. <laughs> what about Willy? <laughs> Slider on some most older skins look pretty good. Dude, stuff like Techno Candy. Like, you look at the Azer skins, because we were just watching Azer. They look so nice. He said prominent. Oh, you think I'm not prominent? I have 210 viewers on Twitch right now. I think I'm pretty prominent. Wait, wait. This is the part. This is the part. I used to freak out when I could hit this, because I, I thought it was so cool. Look. Yes, this is my first 300. Why are you surprised, Synchrostar? This map's easy. This map always has been easy. It's not... No, you don't understand. That's actually true. All old Demonstory maps are actually worth so much now. Oh, 
I just recorded separately because I wanted to emulate like the Wolf Wolf videos where he had like his, his gameplay. But I was like, I'm not gonna do it during a run. I can't do that. You know, you're not gonna get like the magic run. So I just play it again afterwards. <laughs> it's that simple. Solar Sect is worth like 350 no one. Okay, but Solar Sect is OD9. That's different. And it has thirds. Yeah, exactly. I tried the Hard Rock Solar Sect yesterday and I could not hit the thirds even once. I have a Hard Rock 1 miss on Solar Sect and I can't fix it because I can't hit the thirds, dude. It's so sad. Oh man. Some of your skins? I do. I, exclamation skins. Exclamation skins. I've uploaded all my old skins to a drive folder. So if you're ever looking for any of my skins, they're in there. If Shibon fixes what? Wait, hold on. Just choke on this DT. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He fixed it, but it, it, it just it wasn't high enough score to beat it. Like, he FC'd it, but... It, <laughs> It doesn't matter. Is is slider breaking the end? Let's, let's just say it's an FC. It, it's an FC. Let's be honest. <laughs> let's be honest. God, dude, look at these plays. Oh, yep. How to ruin a play? Let's see. Let's see. Let's let's just keep going with these PP records, right? Let's see some crazy stuff. My first four hundred. Here we go. Yeah. Now we're now we're talking. Now we're talking. <laughs> Bear is some fun, my beloved. Aim 400. This was hard for me back then, bro. I was top 50 on the map, okay? I deserve some credit here. This was the play that got me to three digits. This is no mod. This was the play that got me to three digits. It was my top play. It was my, my first 400. My first 400. By the way, my, my, my other play after this. It was after I was in like a huge mental block for a year where I just thought I couldn't do any plays. But I was still improving during that time. And I, I the catalyst to all this was I FC'd Die Die Genome. I, I, for the longest time, I could not do it. And I was so sad because all my friends could FC Die Die Genome. And I was like... I can't do it, I can't do it. So, like, the, I, I think earlier in this stream, because I was streaming on Twitch, I FC Die Die Genome for the first time ever. And I, I like, I was like, oh my god, yes, yes, I did it, I finally did it. And, like, I, I just, it clicked. I finally got it. So I was like, oh, why don't I play this? I got a one miss run on this, or not a one miss, I got, like, a bunch of misses. But I was like, oh, that's pretty easy. Let me just try it again. And I FC this, I FC this in, in two tries. Got my new top play by uh, 80 PP. My old top play on this, or, or my old top play before this was the, the second or third diff on Inferno, one of those diffs, right? And it was 367 PP. This one was 442 when I said it. And it brought me, it brought me to three digits, like I said. And within a week, in a week, you can see on my Amiya Bia, you ready for this? Here, let me show you. For for anybody who hasn't seen it, I brought this up on stream before, but I think this is this is really good to look at, right? Uh, you can see my rank over time, right? Especially around uh, around this time. So, right here, I, I got to to rank one k, right? Simple. And I was sort of hard stuck at one k for an entire year, literally an entire year. Like this is October, you know, October. I finally hit one k, October twenty fifteen, right? And I was stuck at the same rank. I could not gain ranks. Or it just like felt like I wasn't gaining ranks ever, right? Even though I, I, you can see there is an upward trend here, it just felt like I just wasn't gaining ranks like I should, right? And then the day happened. Whoop! 
In a week. In a week, I went from rank 1.1k to 600. Because I, I just got rid of that mind block. I was finally able to actually set scores. Literally. That's all it took. That's all I had to do. <laughs> oh. Because, you know, after this, there were so many farm maps that I also choked. That I already, like, had really good chokes on that I just could not FC. And then once that mi that mental block was completely gone, I was just like, oh, let me just go back and FC all these maps that I couldn't FC before. Because obviously I'm good now. What's the website? Uh, Osu Track. Amiobia. Osu Track. Amiobia. <laughs> oh, anyway. Seventy VP, yeah, dude, that's dude. Actually, fun story. I am so confident in my skill level, but people didn't believe in my skill level, like, like for a really long time. Like one of my friends, even though I FC'd this, right, a year after, I was kind of hard stuck at, at at rank six hundred. I stayed at rank six hundred for like two or three years, okay. And I was really hard stuck, and and one of my friends was like. Or, or after I stopped caring about PP and my, I was letting my rank deteriorate, he was like, you don't practice aim. You got to practice aim, which is true, which is true. And, and he challenged me on stream. He was like, I bet you can't even do if you can't hang again. I was like, watch. I went and I one missed it. I one missed like nearly SS the map. I was like, I'm telling you, I still have the aim that I built up before. I'm just not good at aim yet. Like, he thought that I had just, like, lost all my ability to aim because I was just too busy playing flow aim maps and stuff. But I, I, I showed him. I it made me feel so good. I showed him his boss. I was like, no, I did not forget how to aim. I know how to aim. Oh. I know. All anyone ever wanted to do was help me. They were like, you know, you should try and play faster maps. Oh, you should try and play some more maps to get your aim better, right? <laughs> and then I would just be like, um, but I'm so bad. And I would cry about it. It's so funny. Beneath the rust, three-digit Lily's still there. Yeah, that's, that's a good way to think about how that was. I'm better than I've ever been. I, I feel like I'm in a good spot and I'm playing... I'm playing so much less than I used to, but I'm still getting better, which feels good. What do you guys think of this skin? Suddenly there's a good Willy skin on screen and nobody has any complaints. Isn't that weird? <laughs> Needs more slider ends. Oh my god, I can't win. I can't win. DT skin? Nope, this is a Nomad skin. I didn't- I was not capable of playing DT back then. I just did this. Wait, let me see. Ooh! Good skin, by the way. <laughs> hey, you guys- you guys want to talk about my skin? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this is the good part. You ready? Okay, this is important. Here it is. Okay, look at this. Here we go. This is the moment that got me 442 PP. Wait for it. Notice my act. Oh. <laughs> See, I was top. I was like top thirty on this map, by the way. People forget uh, that I was actually a little good <laughs> at the game back then. It's just a silly pick and nothing more. <laughs> why? Why do you make that sound so suspicious? I bet you're upset from that one hundred. No. I mean, I, yeah, back then I kind of was. Dude, okay, this one's funny. This one's funny. Squilly. <laughs> does, any, does anyone even remember Squilly? Dude, Squilly and I were good friends. 
And, and back then, you, we were in the Willy Osu server, the same Willy Osu Discord server that you can join today. But it, I, I had the, like just a tendency to keep 100 in plays. Like you can see, the plays that I uploaded before this and after this are both 1 100. Look at the screenshots. And he was like, Can you just SS a map for once in your life? Can you just SS a map for once in your life? And he sent that message. I went to play my narco and I SS'd it instantly. <laughs> It was really funny. It was like the funniest turn of events ever. I don't know. Maybe I just needed I just needed him to talk some sense into me. <laughs> uh. What about this skin, dude? <laughs> At least I was experimenting with different hit circles back then still. Easy. True. Skin is what is wrong with you? Come on, the encircles look cool. I made them so cool. I'm sad. I made them so cool. I'm still friends with Squilly? Yeah, dude, Squilly's awesome. We don't talk often, but I mean, I'd still consider him a friend. Probably because he doesn't really play Osu. <laughs> Squilly's the OG. The, the not like 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 super duper OG like like uh like Peachik but but you know Mouse One uh, X, he's the true gamer. I want a Milky Way. God. This is this is my accuracy farmer arc right here that you're seeing. So this, this definitely helped my profile. I I can tell you that much already. Why did you just send that? How much people is this? Oh yeah, there it is. Look, look, there's the quote. There's the quote in the description. Oh my god, that's follow. so good. You're done for now. Uh, 371 PP. I throw that in there. No reason at all. Of course, of course, naturally. All right, what's another play? Hmm. Oh man, I was I used to be so upset at myself and mad when I couldn't do plays. Bad attitude. This was before this. I I played this map not to brag or anything. I knew about this map way before anyone else did. I played this map. This is when it was unranked. This was months before it got qualified, or at least maybe like a month or two or something. I uploaded this video on January 19th, 2017. This got ranked February 2018. This just got submitted like a month before and I was like, oh, that's a pretty cool map. I like that map. That was fun. <laughs> I was ahead of the curve, okay? You hear me? Ew. Okay, this skin kind of sucks. I'm gonna be real to you. This skin's kind of bad. Thoughts on this skin, guys? So true, so true. Now, you know who inspired this? Angel Sim going ham. I can already tell you that. That's what the black border is for. Yeah, 
The skin has no soul. Kind of true, though. Actually, kind of true. Does this map have a storyboard? Put white flashing lights all over it? Why? Look at this. Man. To blind everyone. Oh. Oh, okay. Naturally. Oh, true sabotaging sequel. Sorry, this is fun. BTMC tourney in two minutes. Ooh, exciting, exciting. Okay, okay. So, look, you want a good skin, guys? Hold on, hold on. Azer's like techno candy edit was a good skin. I don't care what anyone says. It was a good skin, okay? This, this skin. They, they use for this. And here, maybe. Wait, what do you use for imaginary? Like, just he use this. Okay, okay. Look at this. Look at this skin. I'd rather. Since you guys want to talk about, oh, skins with slider ends look so bad. Look at this. This skin's awesome! Tell me this skin isn't good. The 1026 guy. No! Oh, what have I done? Oh, you know what I should do on this account? I should follow, like, Happy Stick. Okay, I'm already following. Azer? Am I following Azer? I gotta follow the classic people. You know? First skin here is a banger. Do you follow Wolf? Of course I do. Skinner, yeah, this is an Azerino edit. This is like the this this reminds me of like the Kablaze Azerino edit. Yeah, Azerino is a really good skin just normally. Like the hit sounds on Azerino are really solid. They're good hit sounds. I think they're 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 pretty much these hit sounds. I think they are these hit sounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. Ah, these hundreds. Where's the BTMC stream? Two PST exclusively at twitch.tv slash BTMC. Hey Ed, where's the stream, Ed? Where is it, Ed? They're probably getting set up. 
Sorry, I hope you don't mind this music. <laughs> Let's go XQC. <laughs> We're in the act, but it's still good. Man, this map. This was only 488 PP back then? Oh my god. Guys, this is like 580 PP now. You know that, right? That's so much PP. That's... What? How is that so little? He's live. Look at this. Wait, wait. Hidden hard mark. I wonder if I could find Azer's score in this. Azer. 528. Okay, okay. It's less than... Okay, 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 the Biko play threw me off. Okay, okay, whatever. That's still a pretty significant game, like 50 PP almost. He's not live, you're lying. Oh wait, I tried to refresh? Okay. You're lying. 10 more minutes? Okay, perfect. That means we have a couple minutes to do stuff, or eight minutes? Here, Should we can watch this Azer play. Jam it. Go. Do people only care about it? I don't Holy care. shit! <laughs> 500? 500? Look at this. 500? Dude. Never mind. 488. Fuck! <laughs> the dream is dead. <laughs> The dream is dead. I, I don't think I'm gonna get better than that. That was really good. But it's not 500. God damn it. Man. Look at that. First hidden hard rock I've seen on this, now. actually. 17, there we go. When you actually had to check PP on the website? I know, I know. It was a crazy time. What was Osu like in 2015? Ah, it was interesting. I mean, it was this. It was this early 2015. It was pretty crazy. It, it, was, it was a very quaint, like, nice game. Um... Mid 2015, the Cookie Z returned and, and upset everything. Everything was, was going insane. And then the end of the year, he actually got unbanned. And that was probably the biggest Osu event ever. 2015, I think, was, was a golden age of Osu. There's been like a few golden ages. I couldn't tell you when. But I think that 2015 definitely was one of them. I don't know what it was. It was like Twitch Osu streaming culture was evolving with stuff like this, right? There was some big streamers finally, you know, finding their footing. There was lots of really good players. The ranking was in a an okay position because it like although there were farm maps that were like horribly overweighted farm maps, there weren't a ton yet because it was only 2015, right? There's only like a year worth of abuse of the PP system instead of, you know, by 2018 there was like what, 4 years of farm maps that and and the PP system not being updated that ruined it, right? Everything was really good to early 2018. I disagree. I think Probably early 2015 to mid-2016 or late 2016 was the golden age. I still don't think 2017. I, I think 2017 was like a different era. It, it wasn't just like... Like like you can think, Cookie Z was setting really good plays into 2017 and, and Angel Sim was and, you know, Raphis was and all these people. But it's it, it's not about the plays. It's not just about the plays, you know. Mapping was doing amazing. Oh, man so much so much stuff so much stuff happened in this time man it's really good it was it was a great time the osu for fools in 2015 yeah i mean 2015 was osu coins right buy the coins man that was like the last time they had like a huge april fools joke oh Maybe you're right. I've only been around since early 2017. Yeah, the thing is, 2017, there was like... 
mapping was different stuff was different farm maps were, were starting to be like really abused hard the code for a sequence is there just didn't feel like using it again this year or something yeah i know i know it's just funny it was a good it was a good a good april fools it was actually like a really funny april fools 2022 has been awesome yeah we might be see this is the thing you never know i feel like like you know in history and like real world history but also in in you know just osu history you never know when you're in a golden age until it's over you know what i mean you just think like oh things are good you don't know if it's good or if it's you know if if the golden age has started if we're in the middle of it or anything you never know how long anything's gonna last Yeah, dude, you had you had just had like a ton of people, a ton of people in the game who love the game. You know, it wasn't just a lot of people who who, who cared about you know. At least th this happens to every game, right? It happens to every game when it gets big. It, it, it's not like monetization. I think that's part of it as well, right? So you did have people who were streaming, you did have people who were making YouTube videos, but they weren't doing it for the money. You know, they're just hanging out. They were just having fun. You know. 2015 was very different. That's what I'm trying to say. It was very huge. But that's just the the way of the internet in general, right? Speaking of monetization, hey, if your subs are running out, you should renew them. Wink, wink. You excited for USC? No. I don't really... I don't follow USC closely. I just... I, I haven't because I have my own gripes with USC. I think... I, I've said this before. I don't want to go on forever on my whole like like ten minute spiel about USC. I don't like how they determine like like who ends up in 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 what teams. I don't like how they they arbitrarily decide the states and stuff like that. But you know, if it's if it's exciting, if the teams are fun, then then sure, maybe I'll watch. I don't know. I just ever since I, I haven't been able to compete with my stateless boys, it's it's not been the same, Junjo. I want to come back. I want to come back. I can't do it. Will Rectagon even be eligible? What do you mean? What? His tourney ban's gone, though, right? So why wouldn't he be eligible? People from Malasia cannot enter USC. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> that's uh, you win. That's that's Twitch message of the day. I, I'm framing that. I'm taking your message, I'm taking a screenshot, I'm getting it framed and I'm putting it on my wall. That one wins message of the day. Alright. Are they talking? It's just music, so we're probably gonna raid, right? Um, I'll hang out in, in Discord voice if you guys want to do a watch party, if you want to watch this with me, because this is gonna be a hype event, okay? But um, apart from that, uh, thank you guys so much for coming out. I won't be streaming tomorrow or on Sunday, unfortunately. Does Osu track only track your stats from the first day you use it? Yeah, you have to like reload the page every single day that you want to track, so that's something. So. Tournament starts 3rd of, 30th of July. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, I, I see what you mean now. I'm not sure. But uh, join the Discord if you want to hang out. Discord.gg slash Willy. I'll be back on Monday. Monday, same time as always. Hey, guys. When do I start streaming? Noon EST. 16 UTC. Okay? Post your, your, your current time subtracted by 5 hours and 10 minutes. That's when I start streaming. Okay? You guys got it? You guys know when I start streaming? You know when you could be there? All right, I'll see you again on Monday. It'll be fun. Who knows? Maybe, maybe I'll be partnered by then. Maybe they'll respond to my partner app. That would be fun. I could do the huge event. Look at this. <sighs> Good morning, guys. Welcome to the roundtable right. well, summer 20. It's time for the roundtable, so I'll meet you guys in Discord. Thank you so much for coming out. Thank you for staying for five hours today on the stream. See you guys later. 
join Discord. Discord.gg slash Willy. Discord.gg slash Willy. Discord.gg slash Willy.